Welcome in, y'all. Welcome in. Happy Friday. How are y'all doing? Hope your day's going well. If not, I hope it gets better. I think I didn't mess that up. I always, there's always something right before I start saying it that like comes up and I'm like, oh, I should have fixed that before. I always forget. So like headphones, right? You have them on. I can't talk with them on. I always have to take one off because it sounds weird. You know, it like, I don't know. It does that muffle thingy. So where I can't hear myself. So it always trips me up and it always happens. Every time I'm recording a short, I have them on. And then I like start speaking and I don't notice that I hate it till I start speaking. I'm like, oh God, wait, hold on. <laughs> it distracts me, but welcome into Okalas and welcome to Baku and welcome in Helldiver. How's y'all day going today? Oh my God, today's Friday. Can y'all believe it? Holy shit. We always make it to Fridays and stuff and I'm just like, how is it already Friday? It was Tuesday yesterday. Oh man. Let's see nothing going on here. Just having some fun. Nice, nice. Hi. <laughs> Oh, man. oh yeah, and I think I think I got the things working. Hold on. Nobody touch anything. The redeems I think I fixed it. I felt like Tuesday, right? Right? Today did not feel like oh, I did it guys. I'm such a fucking tech wizard. It was actually really stupid um, So welcome to do this. Happy Friday <laughs> So I fixed it what happened was it was turned off I don't know how it got turned off, but it did get turned off. So I turned it off well, no. Or I might have turned it off, but I don't think so, because I didn't even know there was a switch for that. So, yeah. But yeah, I got it back. We got the pipes. We got the helmets. We got we got the bonk. We got Flat Rika will make a return once again, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, man. Tap the tech wizard. Exactly, exactly. I'm, I'm a certified Hello. genius over here. Hello. There we go. Man, it's been a while since I've heard all those. Holy shit. I was kind of starting to forget it. Starting to forget my roots. <laughs> oh my gosh. But yeah, time to spend a break. If y'all turn it off again. Like, I... It was so weird. I had disconnected it yesterday and, you know, did the complete thing to make sure to reconnect it to the account. And I was like, okay, there shouldn't be anything, like, any other issues, right? Because, like, uh, another program that I use, Touch Portal, right? Which helps with, like, the points and the... Well... Does it have to the point? I don't know. It, it does stuff, right? And so, like, that was the main thing. So I wouldn't be surprised if that had broken because it has a history of breaking before with, you know, like the, the dang it redeem and the penny one that I never got to work and now lo no longer exists. I deleted it because I just gave up and I was like, it, it's not that big with you. <laughs> oh my god, this is going to be the first tree that I can catch with the redeems. Let's go! Ooh, uh, put exclamation point points. Let's see how many you've racked up. In a way, I've, I've, uh, what has it been able to allow you to save your wealth? You know, like snowballing your wealth, like to where you start off with like this amount and then you save over time. So I guess save? I don't really know. You know what I mean. Welcome in, Antonio. How are you doing? Everybody's going well. If not, it was better. Happy Friday. Holy crap, we're at Friday again. It just keeps hitting because like Friday and then tomorrow, tomorrow, by the way, if you're a member, there's going to be a member stream. So. Yeah, it was really funny. I don't know who it was, but uh, here's a little bit of member stock. There was a poll that I put out for members, and <laughs> it was at a tie, and I was like, hey guys, by the way, if it ends on a tie because I have to make a decision, I'm just not going to do the thing. And then immediately, like I swear, it was like two minutes after I sent that post, it fixed itself. So I was like, heh, there's my members. They know how I work. <laughs> a member wimber. Exactly, exactly. Oh my god, there's too many. Wait, how many do you- Wait, 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 wait. Wait, you only have z- Ha? Huh? Okay, that does- that's- there's no way that- Okay, hold on. Helldiver, I'm making an exception here. I'm gonna give you points, because I know you've been here a while, and I, I will not stand for that. Here, we'll give you 10,000. Yeah, I think that's good. I, I'm sharing my wealth here. Wait, is it give points user or give user points? I think it's give user points. At Hell Diver. There we go. I think, because, like, he's been here a while. I mean, y'all have seen him. He is very active. I feel like, I mean, maybe he wouldn't have earned exactly 10,000, but it would have been, like, in the thousands, I think. And I'm too lazy to do the math, so, you know, I'm just like, eh, 10,000. <laughs> Wait, it failed. Dang it. Here, hold on. It's okay. Just got it. Keep going at the RNG. Good thing this doesn't, <laughs> this doesn't cost us too much. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, baby! baby. Why is it not giving? Win. Let's see. It's not saying why it's failing. Am I doing it bad? I can give it- I know the command by heart. 
<laughs> Let's see who do, who does it first. Let's see. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Did it do it? Did it, it? It's still failing. Why is it failing? Oh my gosh. Did, am I doing it wrong? Maybe it goes after? Because I know that was something that I did last time too. That I was like, oh yeah, like this. And yeah, we're like, no, it goes the other way. Maybe that one. It was not that one. <laughs> oh my god, why is it failing? Holy crap. We got some, like, what is it called? Whenever they take over the economy. Someone has a... Oh my god, it failed three times in a row. Hold on, let me check the settings. It shouldn't be affected. I haven't touched the settings. Hold on, what is it? Stream Labs. There we go. How is it failing? Oh my gosh. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, where be commands? And then, where are the commands at? I don't have any command. What do you mean I don't have any commands? What do you mean I don't have any commands? Do I not? Are you sure? It was through here. Was it loyalty? How do you- hold on. <laughs> Tech wizard, something immediately happens. There was a thing, hold on, because I don't go through this often. But I know there's like a thing. Default. Okay, it's under default. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Oh, there's giveaway things apparently. Quote, Q, media share, loyalty. There it is. Give. Yeah, no, it's enabled. Why is it failing? Can you, can you unfail, please? I don't know, it's not, it's not, not doing it. It's not giving. Does it give to anyone? <laughs> Let me spawn a newcomer. Exactly. Oh my gosh. Works for others. Why is it being weird? Hold on. Let me let me see one more thing. Maybe. Maybe. Mm, ba -ba -ba. I can search through the log of everyone. Because what it may be is that maybe it doesn't have a log of his account. And then from there, it's like, hey, this user doesn't exist. And that may just be it. Which is so strange. I don't think I've ever seen it do that. I mean, I have so many people on here who are like, I don't even know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, I don't... That is so strange. Yeah, oh, it did it! It did it! Pog! You guys are good, but the fact that it's failed multiple times, I actually find it funny. <laughs> Pog! Maybe that was it. Hold on, maybe I can find his account now. Let me... Here, let me send that, and then, yeah, I think that was the right thing. And then let me see, hell, if I just search that, no. Maybe it has to be full name? Hell Diver 148. Yep, there it is. Yeah, see, it like just logged him like eight minutes ago. So yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> that is so interesting, now we know. Oh my gosh, new people, we gotta wait a little bit before giving them stuff, because otherwise it doesn't log it, and then it just, like, repeatedly fails. <laughs> that was so crazy. Solving a mystery here. We're the mystery gang, the Scooby-Doo. I have a pack of cookies right here, so don't be surprised if you hear me like, because I'm hungry. What are these? These are Maria's Gamesa. That's what, that's what they say. I don't know, they're, like, sweet cookies. It's- it's a whole pack. Y'all know how, like, they sell the boxes yeah, with packs of Ritz baby. crackers? It's That's like that. I love Ritz crackers. Okay, let me- let me- there we go. There we go, everything's back to normal. <laughs> I gave JJ almost a thousand when they first came in. Holy crap. Did you say you could- what? Did you say that so you could say you're getting a scoop of No, but that would have been a really smart thing to do. <laughs> I'm just- I'm just munching. I was just like, oh, I kind of want a cracker because I made a- I'm gonna say eye contact with the crackers, but you know what I mean. Like, I just saw them and I'm like, oh yeah, they go. So, yeah. Hmm. They're so sweet. They probably go really, really good with uh, coffee, but I don't like coffee. Yeah, it was crunchy. I usually like bite like a little piece of the cookie and then it breaks in half and then from there I put the halves in my mouth. But I was like, oh, I don't want to get crumbs on myself. So I shoved the whole cookie in. Not the greatest idea. 
I, I couldn't <laughs> I couldn't move my mouth for a second. But yeah, they are yummy. Yep, yep. I wonder if I'll finish the whole pack by the end of stream or not. I don't know. I need to eat. I like okay. No. Well, okay. I ate earlier today. I ate like two sandwiches. And then after that, I was like, oh, I'm really, really hungry again. And so I went to look and I like, I wasn't craving anything. And so from there, I was like, oh, I'm not sure. I don't know what to eat. I don't know what to eat. And I really, really wanted something sweet. And we had nothing sweet except for like this one single, like, uh, like a single portion of this like strawberry ice cream. Sundae. Okay. Little rant on the Sundays, right? So we have little like Sundays. They're little like individual packagings, right? And they sell them at the stores. Like it, it's a not a bulk pack, but it's like 12 of these little ones, right? And they'll have six of chocolate Sunday ones and six of strawberry Sundays ones, right? I don't like Sunday flavor, Sunday, the hell, strawberry flavoring all that much, right? So I tend to not get strawberry things with the exception of like artificial strawberry candy. That's the only exception I make. And pink cake, which I think still counts as artificial strawberry flavoring, right? So I usually stick with chocolate. I'm, I'm very plain. And so whenever we bought those, we were at the store, like my siblings were over and we were like, oh yeah, you know, we want to get something sweet. And my dad was like, how about we get ice cream? And we're all like, yeah, okay. And so we were trying to decide on like one pack of, uh, of like, you know, ice cream treats or whatever, right? And we couldn't choose one, right? Because we all had different tastes. We we're like, oh, well, I want something fruity. I want something with vanilla. I want the, like the fruity vanilla pops. And it's like, no, no, let's just get the fudge bars. You know, I'm, I'm a fudge bars advocate. <laughs> so like we were saying all that and then we even talked about like oh maybe we can get our own individual pints and my dad was like why don't y'all just take that packet right there and it was the ones with like little sundaes but i know this from personal experience we always go for the chocolate and vanilla ones and we never finish the strawberry ones so the strawberry ones sit there for months on end and don't get finished meanwhile the chocolate ones are gone within like the span of one week so i was like no because then they're not going to eat those and then i'm going to be left since i live here with all the strawberry ones and i don't even eat the strawberry ones and i know y'all don't eat any of the sweets that we ever buy so like no let, let's just not do that let's just get like another one and my dad was like oh but like no and then uh my siblings were like that's not true we eat the strawberry ones we only eat the strawberry ones we don't eat the chocolate ones they said all that shit right talked all that shit to this day okay that was like a month ago to this day there's still one of those fucking strawberry sundae ones and no more chocolate ones <laughs> now albeit they did let me eat like majority of the chocolate ones by myself so you know that was great i didn't mind that but now they're just like i keep wanting ice cream and i just like look in the fridge and there's fucking you know strawberry ice cream one that i don't want and it's just like it's mocking me <laughs> oh my gosh Let's see. Don't do it. It's the space just. Oh wait, wait. What? Why? Why Muppet Rika? <laughs> you mean? Oh yeah, you mean you need birthdays today. That's right. That's right. Oh my God, we're gonna have a whole surprise or something. Maybe. I wonder. Do I have like a party popper thing? Do I have like a birthday cake? Oh, but what if they never show up? They might. But also they might not. Hold on. Let me see if I even have anything. Do I have like a party hat or something? <laughs> like party hat on on me and on y'all and then we'll be like it, it's your birthday we wanted to say happy birthday let's see do i have a birthday hat let's see birthday nope maybe maybe uh cake we have minecraft cake <laughs> i actually like strawberry so if you just donate to me please oh yeah i'll send it virtually you get my my final virtual strawberry sundae. You can finish it for me. <laughs> Wait, I forgot about anybody else that donated. Just thank you. Fine. <laughs> no worries, no worries. That's what being part of the peppers is like. There's there are puppet recon. Silly goof. Silly goof. Oh, oh, okay. Let's see. Uh, ba -ba -ba. I was like, what's what's silly goof? But I realized that's the channel. Let's let's see. His birthday is it? It's Unimo's birthday. Dude, <laughs> dude, it's so cursed. Let me see, let me see. Ah, uh, silly goofy mood. Oh my god. <laughs> that is so cursed. That would be so funny. I would love to like make one of those. Let's see, Discord is gonna miss even though I have the TTS off no matter where I go. <laughs> you must have trouble in the Discord. Oh man. That is so funny. I, I have been thinking like every now and then I keep like kind of daydreaming about like oh what if I do this stream what if I do that stream and one of the ideas that keeps like reoccurring for like to me 
that's like, oh, well, what if I do like a puppet stream? Which like I've talked about before and y'all were like, oh, that would be so funny. Yeah, you should totally do it. And I do want to, but it's like, oh, well, I don't even have any puppets. Like I, I only have one hand puppet and it's like, I think y'all have seen... Y'all haven't? Oh my god, y'all haven't seen my little elephant hand puppet. Welcome in, that guy. How are you doing? Everybody's going well. If not, it was better. Happy Friday. <laughs> Oh my god, but yeah, I have this like one hand puppet and it's for babies. I swear to god it's for babies. I got it in the like baby section of Walmart. But I thought it was really really cute, so I got it and I like, I play with it and I'll like do a little like, whenever my friends are over and I find it, I'll like put it on and I'll be talking to them, right? And so I'm like moving my hand too and pretending like he's the one saying it or whatever, but I don't do a voice, it's just me, but I'm like moving the thing too. Because I find it funny and they find it funny too and it makes me really happy and so like I've thought about it and it's like, oh I should do that, that would be fun, but then I'm like, oh well no. I only have one and I don't know <laughs> oh my god welcome in Vanellope uh, I think no I, I don't think I said that uh, hope your day is going well if not it was better happy Friday let's see I know what game you're playing pep if you don't typically rage at this game this should be no problem if you do then that's a different story this is not my first time playing the game as many of y'all can attest to uh, so yeah <laughs> It's like a really mixed bag because like when I started the game I was like, oh, yeah, I got this. I can do this. I'm good gamer. I will game good, you know, and then uh, Like for two two or three streams. Is this a fourth stream? I don't even know But like for a while I just sucked ass at it. I was kind of learning but like it was taking a really long time so you know, there was that, and I was like, okay, I just suck at the game, and then I got kind of like, not sad, but a little bit sad, like, oh man, time to go and fail at this game, like I did last time, and the time before that, and so, you know, I was already like, okay, fine, whatever, I'll just like, I've, I've accepted my fate, uh, and then I got, for some reason, not really good at it, but like, kind of good at it, so, <laughs> she's a rage, I'm not that rage, she's happy and slowly lost her life, <laughs> definitely rage that games in a calm way before, yeah, it's like, my like my rage because at first like i just i i tend to be very like it's fine it's okay it's fine right but there are sometimes where like things do do get frustrating for me and so i'll be like why aren't you and then i realize like this is a game why are you trying to talk to the game and then i'll be like because i realize like usually it's it's a me issue it's a user issue but i'm just like <laughs> I feel like I'm doing as much as I can, but it's not working. The amount of peak yelling I got from this game. <laughs> what do you mean you don't rage? I, I usually don't. It's only this game that I've had like a little bit of issues with, but even then, like I haven't... Never mind. <laughs> never, never mind. <sighs> I just remembered the poor like... <laughs> the poor condition of my mouse. No, he's fine. My mouse is fine, surprisingly. I mean, I'm, I think y'all can hear, I don't know, I haven't watched like the full VODs of them. Sometimes I just like go through, I haven't, that's a lot of mess. Uh, I haven't watched my VODs in like a hot minute because I've been kind of like, <laughs> you know how like, okay, when there's like a schedule that you got to follow and then you fall like slightly behind and so you're, like, you're just constantly catching up to it. Well, that's been me like this entire two weeks. I'm really, really Hmm. I, hmm. I struggle to stay on task, as you can probably tell. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is really close. I've seen a raging, to be honest. What was yesterday? Yesterday? Oh, yesterday wasn't that bad, I think, if I remember correctly. It was just like, I was so confused, and then, like, literally, my brain was mush after that stream. Oh man, you're writing some more of the poor bots. Random number between one and four? Uh, three. Find the thing named Deuces now, please. <laughs> For the mental sake of us all, we do not need this brain rot. Wait, what brain rot? I want you to most thing to read out loud. I'm so curious. Man, I may love him, but ban. Ban. Wait, what was it? Now I'm curious. Let's see. I don't see anything. Let's see, let's see, let's see. <laughs> ban. <laughs> oh my gosh. But with that, we're gonna go ahead and move into the game. I, I can't ban the one mod that I have. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Let's see. Let's see. Actually, wouldn't it be funny if, like, I banned him for, like, five minutes? <laughs> you know, it says your Discord is reading through a lot. Oh, yeah, she probably has that, like, read aloud speech thing enabled. 
the like accessibility thing i don't remember how exactly you enable it i'm pretty sure it's in like your settings so if she's on mobile that would make a lot of sense if she like clicked on a lot of stuff but it's probably that if not if it's on your computer I don't know because i know that if you highlight discord messages on your computer then it does or at least for me it gives me the option to like read aloud and so maybe that but i don't know <laughs> now pick a number between one and three uh well there's only one number but two let's see who will behave please <laughs> say funny thing oh i see i see mute them for eternity can i bonk myself no i don't think i can it would be funny though if there was like a button that i could used to bonk yeah i mean i can kind of i could i could do this and <laughs> no y'all won't remember it because we'll be we'll just be stuck in the loop uh let's see a lot of things can happen in five minutes of the stream yeah <laughs> oh man that's just how it is though that that's the vibe okay now now i gotta connect this bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. this one this one this one i think it's a mix of like I don't want to say I have ADHD because I'm not sure if I do, but it would make a hell of a lot of sense if I did. So it's just, I don't know, a mix of me jumping from topic to topic and then y'all also jumping from topic to topic with me. Let's see. Okay. That. And then resume. And then, okay, sweet. We got a controller now. You know, I have a little program or whatever that's supposed to be like, oh, look, you can control like your, your controller connection to... And you can put hands on it and then you can put that on screen for streaming and stuff i've not been able to figure out how to make it connect so that's why i don't have hands because trust me i want to but <laughs> i don't let's see now choose one or two mm, one no i don't have that button for me i mean hmm. <laughs> i don't doubt i might have something more jumpy not in a bad way what are y'all doing in there? Now I'm curious. I'd, I'd try to make it a personal policy to not go on Discord or Twitter uh, during streams because then it, it will like always get it'll get me reading. Oh, this is this is bad. Hey up. How am I? How? Oh no. Oh wait, okay, I forget, I can swing. No, I fucking can't apparently, holy shit. Is this no swing? That makes no sense. That dang bat, but he has more brain around than an iPad kid. I wonder what it is. Fitness ground pacer test or what? I'm just going to keep a woo for when Pep doesn't like it. Bravo 6 going dark. Gotcha, gotcha. Not writing anything anymore. <laughs> oh man. Hip, hip. Maybe it's a Vaporeon copy pasta? I don't think so. I don't know. Then again, it might be. I feel like the moment that I'm like, oh, I don't think doozits would, would do this, they, they do that. And I'm just like, oh, well, I guess I was wrong. Hep, hep. No, Pizzagram test is normal, right? Like, that didn't feel. Maybe it's a Shrek is Love, Shrek is Life. Man, that died out, like, very quietly. Isn't that strange? People, like, let that die. That's insane. What am I supposed to do here? Oh, wait, that didn't... What am I supposed to do? Dang it. Oh my god. <laughs> I was close. I closed my hands and everything. I was close. That was it. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> Wait, what Vaporeon? Yeah, you know the Vaporeon, while the Bramorant isn't so bad with the bat. Yeah, I'm probably worse. <laughs> Just by a little bit, though. I think, like, it's so weird. I have, like, a weird scale of, like, oh, yeah, this, but then it's, like, gets canceled out by other stuff. Yeah, because that makes sense. Holy shit, I almost fell. Oh, shit. Well, that was mean. Um, but yeah, like, no, actually, I don't want to give examples. <laughs> I'll, I'll preserve my, like, slight bit of, like, oh, yeah, she's a normal, normal VTuber. Normal main wolf here. Hi, it's Paprika, your normal main wolf. <laughs> I'm insane, but no, come on. <laughs> 
I mean, we're all cursed, but I have a strict policy to be clean. Yeah, yeah, see? That, that's, that's my favorite thing about the community. We're all cursed, but not like in a, like, just shows weird thing on screen. It's like a, hey, look at this thing that's not gonna, like, disturb you immediately, but it's just gonna, like, it's gonna be in your brain for a bit. Man, that nail up there must be really, really strong, because there's, like, a nail holding the boards on top. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hmm. There's a way I had it swinging earlier. Dang it. Okay. Yep. Yep. Except male gummy bears. What are you saying? <laughs> See, like, that's a thing. Like, it's not anything like, oh, you know, like, it, it's stuff that intrigues people, you know, that, like, like, if you send someone the, the Vaporeon cop boss, they're gonna be like, oh, you know, that that's weird, that's weird, but the conversation's just gonna be, that's weird. But with the male gummy bears, people are gonna be like, how the fuck did you find that? <laughs> oh my god. You know, it's like, I don't know, deeper questioning. Dang it. Hmm. We're, we're getting somewhere. I don't know if we're getting far. Yep. 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 I like how the, the paint can in the background just kind of says pain. <laughs> this one. That one. That one. This one. And that one. Look at it swinging. What are you, a 1920s jazz musician? <laughs> Oh, 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 and right there. There we go. <laughs> nah, I think the worst thing said in this chat was probably, uh, well, not this, this chat, but, you know, like, this chat in general was, uh, the cockroach milk, I think. That would have to be the worst thing so far. See, it's easy to be pervy. It's fun to be quirky, and apparently funnier to do <laughs> illegal things. Gummy bears and mayo, oh my god. Yeah, or what was it? The Jello, not Jello cake. What else was it? It was like je Jello salad. I think it was. That's weird. But then again, I think Ambrosia salad is also weird because it is. So, you know, <laughs> maybe it's just a biased standpoint. Yep. 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 Gotta swing slower so that way it swings more. So I think the point is to get it to swing whenever it's down, like the, the box that I'm going to swing to. I wonder if this is really what I'm supposed to be doing. Nope, I was close though. So it's probably right. Jello and mayo salad. Yeah, that. Ew. I cannot believe that's an actual genuine thing. Sorry to not introduce this chat to culture of beauty. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, cultural beauty? Huh? <laughs> I would accept, like, cultural amazement or cultural oddity or something like that, but cultural beauty? Excuse me? Huh? Oh, yeah. Kind of unrelated, I guess. I don't know. It gave me the same feeling, and so that's why I remembered this. But y'all know that one video of that guy, and he's, like, vlogging or something? And then, like, a guy starts chasing him, and then he takes off running even faster, and it's just, like, him running for his life, literally. Y'all know that video? Uh, my siblings were watching, like, a meme with it the other day, and I had seen, like, a, a meme, too. I think I saw it on Instagram. Not really a meme, it was more so a video, like, an actual video. And it was like, yeah, you know, the guy was actually running from a cannibal or something like that. And I was like, oh, that's insane. So I saw them watching that video, and I was like, oh my god, I can tell them, like, a cool little fact. And so I was like, did y'all know that guy in the video was running from a cannibal? And they were like, yeah, we know. Like, so nonchalantly. And I was like, what? I could have at least pretended to be a little surprised. <laughs> Sorry, what cannibal? Yeah, yeah. I don't want to hurl into the sun. It honestly kind of is. Oh, man, I think I'm happy I missed that whole discussion. <laughs> Or what cannibal? Yeah, you know that that one meme. It's like a guy in a blue jacket and he has like a backpack, 
and he's like walking through like the forest or the woods or something or like i don't know jungle maybe i don't know very like heavily what is it called Fo foliage area right so he's like walking through that it's probably good hey up hey up hey up hmm But yeah, uh, like a guy jumps out of the bushes from the trail that he's like walking by and he has, I think a stick, I'm not sure. And then he like starts chasing him and you know, the guy holding the camera, he starts running. It, it was just one guy and he just like starts running like crazy. I don't know if it's true or not, but like supposedly there's a cannibal chasing him and I was like, whoa. <laughs> the only cannibal I knew was Shia, Shia above. Oh, I don't know what that is. I don't think I can actually name like a cannibal. I know there's like a bunch of stories where like there was that one guy who came from I think Japan and then he went to France and then he like shot and ate a woman. He has a YouTube channel. <laughs> no, <laughs> it sounds kind of fucked. But like I was watching um kind of like a video essay on it or whatever. And it was like, oh yeah, the, the like, YouTube channels are the worst people or whatever. And it was like people who had actually committed crimes and stuff. And it was so insane to hear about. Good thing about my grandparents, no cannibals can get me here. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> There's like, I don't know, safety in numbers, you know? Jeffrey, all I have to say is... I don't get it. <laughs> there are a lot of Jeffreys. Oh, damn. Oh, yeah, I did it. I will forever no longer trust anyone named Jeffrey, including the giraffe from Toys R Us. <laughs> oh man, am I supposed to swing over there too? Nah, I'm pretty sure I can I can reach it if I just adjust my hands like so. Oh, hey, yep, so close. Hey, yep. Okay, grab. And grab and don't forget the green ones are fucking fake. Wait, it'll actually make you fall, so grab past that. Okay. Hey, yep. Yep, there we go. Good thing I remembered that. Look at all the handprints there. I'm not the only person to have climbed for my life up here. What am I supposed to do here? Oh, I get it. I go left. On your left. There we go. Eh. 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 What? Eh. What? Eh. Oh, I got it. Yep. There it goes. There we go. That's how we do it. Oh, why did Why did it only grab there and then it didn't grab anymore? Okay, I see. I see. Oh my god, I'm saying like so still because I'm like, oh, I don't want to throw off like any aim that I have. But I'm like seated in the t most twisted way you can possibly sit. I don't know, I can't sit down. <laughs> Oh man, I'm way too rusty. It's been too long since I've played Bullet Hell. Not the Bullet Hell games, they're too stressful for me. I say that, but I think I've only played like two different ones. But they were like, you know, on like those sites where it was like unblocked games and you'd play that. Uh, like it, it would have a bunch of different games that you could just play because school would block all the websites. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. Okay, I have a bad idea. Okay. <laughs> I've decided it's too bad of an idea. Up. Damn, I kind of really, really hate playing with a controller, but it's so much easier on my hand, so I can't even complain that much. Eh, 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 eh. Grab, damn you! Grab! Hey, yep! 
Yeah, there we go. Yep, there we go. That's how. Why didn't I think of that? Why didn't I think that was gonna happen? It's so obvious that that was gonna happen. Wait, that means that, like, I have to. Oh. Oh. Yep. Okay, here we go. Maybe I gotta grab the wheels up top? That doesn't seem right. I better not make me grab the wheels up there. Because then I would have to transfer, like, really just fast. Oh my god. Can you just, like, climb up without spamming out at the end? Nope. Impossible. Impossible to do. How do people game with controllers? The only game I like with controllers is Mario Kart. <laughs> Which I think there's no other way to really play it, so, you know, that, that may also feed into it. Why can't this guy use his legs? I feel like that would help a lot. Um... Because legs are just propaganda. <laughs> it's all fake. We don't really have the legs. Yep. Yep. Nope. So, like, the model that they used here is very obviously not how the, like, grabbing boxes were established. Because there's probably, like, a bounding box or something like that that enables you to actually grab the thing. And it's just not at all correlated with the mesh of this, which really bothers me. Because you would think, like, oh yeah, right here, there's no grab. And there actually isn't. But it's, like, weird parts here that only grab. Or maybe it's just not diagonals? Okay, now I understand this a lot more, actually. I thought it was just semi-random, but nope, it's not. Can I grab that? Can I grab that wheel? Hmm. Nope. Hmm. Nope, I don't think I can. I'm gonna chew off my lip before the end of the stream. <laughs> when I concentrate, I start biting my lip. Oh my god! Oh my god! When he was falling, I kind of like... I've told y'all before that I get really, really immersed in games sometimes. So my brain was like, he's gonna hit his head. He's falling head first. That's like more than a concussion at this height. And I was like, oh my god, no! So I like genuinely started panicking for a second, like, holy shit, no, holy fuck. And I was like, wait, wait, this is a game, this is a game. <laughs> oh my god. He can only keep his knees straight. <laughs> Vaseline helps. Oh man. Yep. Hey, yep. Hey, yep. Hey, yep. Now I just gotta do all that again. Yay. Yay. Stand up and fight for your life. Bum, ba, dum, da, da, da. Oh yeah, here's a garden update, because I know y'all are all on the edge of y'all seats about this. <laughs> um, but yeah, in the garden in the back are cucumbers. I think they're cucumbers. No, 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 they're summer squash. They're finally gonna come in, right? Which is really great. But uh, we saw these like red and black bugs on them, and I was really confused, because like, again, me, me nor my dad are really like expert level gardeners gardeners or anything we just he tells me what we want to do and then i research and tell him how to do it you know we're we're a tag team like that and so i just like unswung this so bad um so we found out they were like leaf-footed aphids or something like that like basically babies of this other bug and there's not like a whole lot of information immediately on it it's just like the only information that I found because like at first we just we didn't know what they were called right we just had a picture of them and then I saw like a reddit post and it was like yeah they're like essentially the babies of this bug and all I know is that they're bad I don't know how to get rid of them good luck and I was like damn <laughs> so from there I had to like look up more stuff and essentially what like the internet told me is just like spray soap and water or like grab all of them and put them in soap and water to kill them um and they were like yeah they're really bad and i was like well why are they really bad because whenever people would grab them and put them in the water they weren't exactly like oh they're biting me they're stinging me i have to be really careful i have to wear protection they were just like yeah these bugs are really bad and i was like well, why and then this one lady she had like a very heavy southern accent and like i'm just saying that because it added to the whole thing she was like i hate these critters you know they i'm putting in all this work and then they ruin my crops and i'm like wow what's going on why is she so angry and then she showed us and she was the only person to have showed me at that point where she was like i mean i, I say me but it was a youtube video <laughs> 
But she was like, look at that. They're, they're sucking up all the water from my cucumbers. And then if I take you over here, my tomatoes also had an issue with them. And look at these little tomatoes. They look all discolored and, and they're tiny and they're rock hard. They're inedible. That's what these bugs do. And I was like, oh my God, that's so sad. <laughs> Oh man, that's sad. Yeah, it's sad, but like, you know, it's also true. You gotta, you gotta kill them because it's just like that or, or you spent like, because like a decent amount goes into gardening nowadays because it, it costs a lot unless you have like a lot of connections because like you can build a garden bed in above, in above ground garden bed because you could also do in ground gardening, but there's a lot of like, well, if your dirt isn't good, like for example, if uh, your whole area is like a suburban place that was made by the city so basically underneath your house is not sand but like a mix of clay and not really fertile soil you know then you have to get like fertilizers and stuff right so stuff costs money so it's easier to do it above ground and if you want an above ground bed then you have to pay for the things now if you get like the traditional little beds in the store those are so fucking overpriced guys never get those oh my god it's so much easier to like go through you know like fucking as sketchy as it sounds like craigslist ads and stuff like that to find um what you might call them like free listings for for pallets and stuff uh and you know of course you have to do research on like oh you know which ones and stuff like that uh not really which ones but you just have to make sure they're heat treated rather than pressure treated i believe is what it's called and what that means is like pressure treated they use chemicals heat treated they just like you know put it in the oven i mean not really the oven but you know like an oven and they they burn away all the stuff and like so that makes it safe to plant like vegetables and stuff uh, and then from there you need the dirt right and so it's not just any dirt you have to get like a mix of good dirt because that dirt's going to have all the food essentially for your plants so that they grow and they actually produce vegetables and stuff like that um and so you can use like the potting mixes and stuff but like minimum they come to around five dollars per bag and depending on the garden bed size that you have uh you know it's it gets quite a lot but like you don't want to fill the whole garden bed with it because that just is way too expensive so what you do is you find sticks and luckily we like chopped down some like bushes that we had that we weren't going to use so we saved the sticks like i convinced my dad to save the sticks and so that saved us a lot of money to like essentially help fill up half the garden bed with that right um but it's that and then what we did too is we ended up buying like a mix the first one we bought uh individual bags of the things that we wanted to mix into our garden dirt mix or whatever but this time we kind of did a similar thing except we got the garden mix from like this landscaping company so it it came out to 50 bucks but it's gonna fill like three garden beds so i think it was really really worth it personally but for that you need to have the truck and you know you have to account for gas so like a lot of money goes into the little thing just for you know like I don't, I don't mean to sound like, oh, kill all the bugs, chop down all the trees, but like for a couple little bugs to come by, <laughs> it's so jover, you know, all that work, all that work for like literally nothing, you know? Oh man, such loincloth physics, right? Phasing in and out. I'm sure that if you like frame by frame it, you can probably get a couple shots. <laughs> Dang it. My grandparents have a garden. We live in the rural part of the Midwest USA, but we just dig up some grass and let the plants grow. Ah, uh, that's dope. Yeah, depending on where you live, some places it's easier to garden, some places it's not. Like our place, I would say it's re relatively pretty easy. The only thing that kind of sucks is the sun, but we don't even have like that that much sun to where it's an issue. It's just like kind of more of an issue because we're around like we're starting to get into the summertime and like, I mean, honestly, our place does, it tends to be more on the sunnier side. It's not like I don't know what place is, is rainy. I think Florida tends to be rainy, so oh, shit. <laughs> like that. Like we don't have too many issues, uh, and there definitely are like other parts where you have to worry more about rodents and like, oh, what if deer come by? What if, what if, I don't know, goats? I don't think goats are wild. <laughs> what if a bear comes by? You know, like we don't have to worry about that, luckily. So like we still have it relatively easy, but like it was not necessarily the cheapest to get started because the thing is when you want to go cheap with stuff like that you have to have time to put into it right so like you have to have time to like find where you're going to get the thing for a low cost and how to get it you know and that's like there, there's always a cost to something whether it be time or money or patience 
Oh my god, I need to grow. Yo, dope. One time, um, there was this like house that, uh, that my mom had rented whenever I was young, and in the back, man. Okay, so. <laughs> oh shit! I tried to pause, but, but it didn't pause. Holy shit! It's not pausing. This game is rigged. Hold on, I wanted to rub my eye. Um. But yeah, the house that my mom was renting, in the back of it, there was a pipe that ran out from underground that would spew water. And if you know anything about plumbing, you know damn well what that was for. Uh, I, as a kid, did not. Not that, like, I played in the water or anything. I always saw it and I thought it was kind of, like, like weird-looking water and it always smelled kind of funny. So that's why I didn't go near it too much. But a plant sprouted up from there. And, um... The plant was a cherry tomato plant, and it actually started giving off- Like, there was a bunch of really cool-looking plants in our backyard. Um, and that one started giving off fruit, and so I picked them because I was like, Oh my god, I think these are tomatoes, so I was showing them to one of my cousins. And they were like, Oh, that's so dope! And we washed them, and she ate them because she liked eating cherry tomatoes, like, just like that, which I thought was kind of strange. Uh, and you know, then later that day, I showed my mom. <laughs> she was like, Where did you get these? And I was like, Yeah, in the backyard, there's a plant growing there. And she's like, buy all the water? And I was like, yeah. And she's like, don't, don't ever eat these because that water is not clean. And so I found out uh, like a while later after that, that tomatoes, they kind of like dirty places from my understanding. You can share tomatoes is great. If you wash them, it should be fine. Yeah, no, it, it definitely probably like was fine. Cause I mean, hell, you know, if you really like, <laughs> it's just a matter of like where the, I'm gonna call it compost came from, you know, because like in classic gardening, you just go and buy compost, which is the same thing, but from, you know, an animal and not a person. And, you know, that compost was more so from us. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's insane. You just have a wire fence to keep the animals out. It's typically deer, squirrels, badgers. Snakes are also an issue because we have little kids running around. Ah, oh, yeah, that would be an issue, huh? Yeah, no. We don't have a lot of wildlife over here, which, like, you would think would be kind of sad. And it is a little bit sad, because, like, I've seen one deer in my life. <laughs> well, like, not in the zoo, you know? Like, one deer outside of the zoo, and I thought it was, like, so cool. Um, but, like, at most I'll just get to see squirrels and rabbits. Actually, there was a raccoon not too long ago uh, that was, like, just outside my window. So, like, that's that's just about the critters that I encounter here. But at most, it's, it's usually just spiders. Oh my god, why can't I get a good swing anymore? Hip. Hip, hip. Wait, there we go. This one, that one, this one. Oh. There we go. People are animals too. That's how astronauts grow their cherry to me. <laughs> You're probably right too. Oh man. But yeah, it was just really funny, like, the moment that I learned. Because, like, I didn't... I didn't know. It felt like a jungle was right there. Because, like, oh my god, that reminds me too. Okay, so, like, my room was in the back of the house, right? And so it had a window that would, like, see right into the backyard, right? And we had no fence, so we shared a, a fence with our... We, we shared a backyard with our back door neighbors, which was also our landlord. So, um... Like, there was that, but they had, like... He had, like... A boat parked back there it wasn't like a huge boat but it was like a, like kind of a small boat that i don't think he ever used to be honest but like there was that there were like some used cars oops used cars in the background in the back <laughs> in the backyard uh and there was like a couple of trees on the side and then there was like a lot of tall grass and it just kind of looked like a jungle to me like i wasn't too tiny to where i was like oh man i'm a little kid i'm five i'm imagining dinosaurs in that forest but it was just like I don't know, there was a lot of, um, of foliage, you know? So, dang it. So, like, it was really cool to see something finally give off any type of fruit or vegetable. I think tomatoes are fruits, right? So, fruit, I guess. <laughs> this is Smash a Kids game compared to the Bet Node Core isn't so bad. Yeah, it's really not. This one, I mean, because that's like more of a thinky game, though. Or like a puzzle game. Which, like, is a different kind of hurt. Because this is just, like, repeat until until done, you know? Like, keep going up until you're done. So it's, it's not necessarily complicated. But with stuff like Node Core, I would say it's, like, the Talos principle. But, like... 
<laughs> maybe a little less rewarding but i think that's just because like i mean hell i'm not even too much of like a grindy minecore minecore what the fuck minecraft gamer you know because i just like you know i'll build a house i'll do a bit of farming and then i'll be like okay i'm done and then i won't get on the game for like forever so yeah i just like solving puzzles and then once the puzzle is done that's <laughs> it oh man i, I very non-thinky Turn, turn, turn. Why can't I get this to swing the same way that it was before? There we go. Kind of? Yep. Hey, yep. Hey, yep. Oh, yeah, what I was gonna say. The window to the backyard, right? So it was like very cool to see all the plants and stuff. And in the morning, there was always this like purple flower that would bloom. And so that was very fun. But then also, it was around the time that like SCPs were kind of big online. And uh, there was this, I think it was an SCP or it was just like a creepy pasta thing. And it was like, yeah, there was this like doll or something that I saw by my window. And I kept thinking that it was my friend putting it there because like they kind of described it like similar to my room layout that like, oh yeah, my, my room was in the back of the house and it had a window facing the backyard. And then one day that thing just appeared. And at first I thought it was a smudge, but then it started growing until it turned into like kind of a face. It was really creepy, but I didn't think anything about it. And then like, I told my friend to stop messing with me and to take it down and my friend was like I don't know what you're talking about and then that like one day he was staring at it for too long and that it started like kind of opening its mouth and that it was from what I imagined it it was like kind of tiny but freaky looking and then it started like pounding on the window and like you know those stories where they kind of write it like like oh it's happening right now it's about to break down the window like he was writing that and I was like oh my god and so it kind of freaked me out, so after that I covered my window. <laughs> I was too scared to see something. Oh man, so you need to play Tiles Principle. Yeah, it's pretty good, I would recommend it. I haven't finished it though. <laughs> I'm grinding in games maybe a bit too much, but that's beyond the point. Yeah, yeah. I think it's cool to like work towards stuff in, in games and stuff. But I definitely like, once I decide that like, oh yeah, I'm tired of this game, I get like really tired of the game for a while. <laughs> Hip, 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 hip. How did I, how did I do it last time? Cause anytime I, I get on this side, I'm not. I need to go like that way whenever I'm up. But how would I do that? This one, that one, this one, that one, this one, that one, this one. There we go. Oh, I almost let go. There we go. I'm bad at doing it every day, but if you get me on it, then I'll be there for hours. Yeah, I felt that. I felt that. I definitely get that way about, like, Minecraft farming sometimes. <laughs> I don't know what it is, I just like, I like building those like multi-level farms and stuff like that, or like underground farms too, which I, I rarely do, but I have done before. Cave farms, I like that too. I don't know, I, I, maybe I just like plants. <laughs> Drop to deer picture in Discord if you need a photo for reference, what a deer looks like. I know what a deer looks like, it's just like, I've barely seen them that much. So I guess, yeah, there probably is something in that photo where I'm like, oh shit, that's, that's a new piece of information like i think what is it let's see uh male deer have horns right and then depending on what type of deer they are because there's different kinds of deer they have different fur patterns and stuff and baby deers are the ones that tend to have spots and that seeks into my knowledge to be honest i think they have teeth yeah they definitely have teeth I don't know what kind of formation teeth. I know they have veg vegetarian. I know they have, wait, actually, is it vegetarian? No, herbivore teeth. That's that's what I'm trying to, what's the difference between vegetarian and herbivore? Is there a difference? I think probably vegetarian is just, can vegetarians drink milk? I think I'm thinking vegan. <laughs> Vegetarians just like do the whole vegetable thing, right? So they don't, they don't eat meat. 
Can they eat eggs? I think they can, right? I don't know. I'm so, <laughs> I'm so confused. But yeah, no, I think that's different because herbivores just eat plants. Well, they drink water too. And they probably drink milk when they're babies. Yeah, herbivores can be mammals. I'm scrambling my brain. <laughs> yep. Yep. Nope. Holy shit. Okay. Vegetarian is a diet, whereas herbivore is more about biology and what you can digest. Ah, okay. So then, yeah, that's it. It's more about, like, how it differentiates, because, like... Yeah, yeah, I get it. I was about to re-explain it, and then I realized I was going to re-explain it, and I was like, wait, they just explained it. Why? Why do you want to re-explain it? I think I usually do that, because I'm like, yeah, I understand, and then I repeat to you my understanding, because then I'm like, yeah, look, like, I do get it, right? And I think it's to double check that my understanding is correct. I think. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, back. Ooh, science. Yeah, a little bit of science, Saga Paprika. A little science Rika coming out. She is, she is very rare because <laughs> science Rika barely exists. You know, whenever I was in uh, my biology class, there was this paper that we had to write and it, it felt like very professional or whatever. I don't know what the experiment was about. But it was something like, oh yeah, you have to count the bubbles and it talks about the oxygen or something in the cells or something, something. I don't know, it was something with water and there were bubbles and we were supposed to count how many bubbles there were for like a certain amount of time. And so I did that. And I, I am the type of person who like, I won't want to do a lot of things. And then whenever I do decide to do it, I kind of like not get angry about it, but I'm like, I'm going to do it and I'm going to do it my way, you know? And so I kind of did that, and so my way of doing that was, you know, I, I of course wrote the thing like normal, but then for the title, that was like the most creative part of it. So my title for that for that uh, for that word document was I have 99 bubbles, or like I have 99 things, but a bubble isn't one, or something like that, because it was about like counting bubbles. <laughs> I thought it was really funny. It was really long, albeit, but it was really funny. Um, I don't know what my teacher thought about it. She didn't tell me, like, anything, which I'm kind of glad about because I don't think I can take confrontation. But, um, <laughs> I got an A on that paper, so, <laughs> you know, if, if the results are there, it's there. I actually got all those right, but be glad you don't have to deal with deer in your area. After midnight, they move around and they can do serious damage to you and your car if you hit them. Holy shit, Professor <laughs> Science Rika doesn't come out much. Almost every stream is yapping about philosophy and stuff. Okay, but like, I feel like philosophy is different from science. Cause like, philosophy is as simple as I think, and that's it. Shit, it was right there. Ah, oh, damn it, okay. But yeah, philosophy is like really just, I think, and like, that that's all the argument that you need to have. But science, there's facts. There's, I mean, there is, I guess, kind of, is there facts in philosophy actually? I don't know, isn't philosophy the thing with like that whole argument of like, what is actually the truth? I think. I don't know, it, it kind of sounds like I'm talking down talking philosophy, but I find a lot of it interesting, so there's that. <laughs> oh man, depends on your viewpoint, yeah. Right, right? Hip, hip, hip. So yeah, totally different, totally, <laughs> totally different. with these stiff ass ropes jesus stiffest ropes philosophy is important philosophy is important it it has a lot of the answers that are deeper than just like how do i do this boss it's like why do i do this boss and then that's where philosophy comes in it's like well you do this because you're passionate about it you do this because you need to do it you do this because you have to do it you know it, it answers the why to a lot of stuff i think Everyone is either a philosopher or is stumbling blindly through meaningless existence. Yep. 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 Damn it, I reached it one time. How did I do it? Empirically trying to find objective perspective, I guess, since they all cite many studies to justify their perspectives. That's true. Science can't give us our goals and can't give our life meaning. That's exactly what philosophy does. Yeah, yeah. Exactly, exactly. Wait, do y'all notice that the rope isn't actually attached to this? If y'all look really closely whenever I'm swinging back and forth, it actually, like, kind of lags behind. Isn't that interesting? Sorry, I just noticed that. The ropes are fake. <laughs> the ropes are propaganda. Oh, man. Hip. 
Hey, uh, you know what's really strange though? Y'all know those like, I think it's Mayor Briggs or something like that? Those personality tests where it's like INFJ, ENFP or stuff like that, right? Like I thought they were permanent, but I guess our personalities do kind of change as we grow up. Maybe? Because mine changed. Back in like middle school, I took the test and it said INTP and I took the test like a couple months ago, I think, again, out of curiosity. And it changed to like, I think it was E in something or something like that? I don't remember. But it, I think it was, or was it I in, INFJ or something? I don't know, it was something like that. Some letter had changed. And I was like, oh, this is crazy. But I don't know. Yep, yep, yep. But it kind of like, I don't know, it kind of maybe, not a little sad, but I was like, because like, I feel like the change from me back then to me now is that I feel, oh, this is gonna sound so like mushy, but I feel a little more like in touch with what I feel. So that's kind of nice. But like the one that I got before, INTP was like, oh yeah, you're a smart kid. And you know, you're, you're very much a thinker. Man, this creaking is getting to me. <laughs> You're a thinker, and like it's a rare thing in the world to have this one. And I was like, oh, that's so cool. And then I switched over to another one, which was just like normal. And I was like, oh, I've become normal. <laughs> Mayor Briggs results, I got a little changed a little, right? So I don't feel like it fully represented me. I also felt that too. Yeah, because like as cool as it was to have like that first one, I don't know, it felt very like, like, okay, you're just smart. And like that's what I'd been hearing my entire life. And I was like, I don't feel smart. I'm pretty sure. Like, I mean, it felt a little cool, you know? Because it always feels a little cool for people to praise you. But then it also, like, what else is there, though? And when there's no answer there, you're like, oh, oh what else? <laughs> uh, that one. There we go. Yep. Have to go back home, we'll rejoin when I get there. So about 30 to 45 minutes. Gotcha. See you in a bit. Bye-bye. Be safe. Yep. Yep. Damn it. Yep, that's good enough. There we go. Let's see. I gave up with those because every time I took one, it changed. Every time? How often did you take one? Because if it was like, I don't know, maybe like a year in between, then I would understand that. If you want me to make up some unscientific categories to praise you with, I will. <laughs> no. I don't know what's worse, because I thought about it and I'm like, well, no, because I know they're made up, then I would be like, oh, no, they're just saying that it's not actually true. But if, like, you said something that was like, oh, you're actually, like, very cool in this way, which, like, I mean, to be fair, in a way, the Mayor Briggs is, like, the exact same thing, so, you know, there's that. But it feels a little, like, a little, because I guess maybe because people believe it, but the same can be said with Zodiac, so I don't know what my point is here, but... Like, if you had just made something up and you were like, oh yeah, you know, studies show that this, so you actually qualify as like this kind of person. And I looked it up and it turned out not to be, oh my god, I died. <laughs> I put myself to sleep. Holy shit, my phone actually just blacked right now. Hold on. Oh, it's restarting. Isn't that insane? That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> but yeah, I would, I would feel kind of like, like, kind of, like if you juked me. <laughs> If you were like, hey, this, and it, it actually just did not exist. Yep. Yep. Let's see. Uh, sorry, late. Let's see, about every two months. I get that as teens, we want external validation in some way to understand ourselves, but yeah, sometimes the praise sounds pandering. Right? Right? Well, if being made up undermines the fun, then I have some bad news about the paper <laughs> Yep, and the other gotchas. Uh, it was always on a different site, <laughs> so not reliable. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I never feel smart, but not to brag or anything, but I am pretty good in school. Yeah, because, like, it feels cool, right? Juke to you, too, is the thing. It's utterly- It's unscientific? Oh, my God. I've just been juked so hard. Oh, no. <laughs> this is the science version of the Zodiacs. No. <laughs> Zodiacs are so crazy, though. Hold on, there we go. I'm back. Um, what's the battery at? Actually, hold on. We're gonna go. We're gonna go off a little bit. Okay, it's fine. I don't know why I did that. That's the first time it's done that. Um, what was I saying really quick? Let's see. Welcome in, Wamper. Stopping really quick to say, brother, help me again and give you my energy. Pog, thank you. Energy received. I needed it. I just got juked. 
before you just have to step by your pros and cons, right? Right? You have to, like, grow your own understanding, which kind of sucks because, like, tests like that, I guess, help. Not I guess, but they help in a way where you're like, hey, I don't understand this about myself. Um, can you help me? And the test is like, yeah, that's what I'm all about. You know, I'll help you. I'll tell you exactly what kind of person you are. And you're like, oh, sweet. I don't have to actually do um, all the work on my own. Sweet. Tell me. And then they tell you something and you believe it. But then like there's moments where like it's so funny. You can go one way or the other. You can be like, hey, that's not like my personality type and not do this. Or you can be like, why don't I feel in tune with that personality type, you know? And then you get, like, even more confused. But... Yeah, it's just more rewarding to, to do it yourself. And it also tends to work out more. But yeah, uh, the Zodiacs are confusing because, you know, I'm a Taurus. And so it's like... Oh my god, it got so much more confusing too at one point. I forgot what year it was in, but people were like, Oh, well, you know, it depends actually because, like, there was a, I don't know, fucking star sign realignment. And, like, you know, what's your sun sign? What's your, what's your moon sign? I'm like... What are you talking about? <laughs> oh man, I was already confused whenever I heard about the, the Chinese zodiacs with the year things. Now you're telling me I have to fucking, like, oh yeah, depending on the month and the day. It's like, oh god. <laughs> oh man. Uh, you know why different websites would give you different merit results? Because there's no coherent standard. Yeah, that does make sense. In a way, you're young and you want to find excuses for your shortcomings. Oh, I'm an IFPSJ. <laughs> Element <laughs> OP. Also, a reason to instantly disengage from meaningful interactions, nuance. Yep. Ew, you're such a Giuseppe, typically. Yep, exactly, exactly. But yeah, Taurus, you know, it's like, oh yeah, you know, you're kind, you're an earth sign, you're down to earth, you're very chill. And I was like, okay, yeah, you know, that that's kind of me, I guess. And then, like, uh, one day I was at I was at a job that I had right and this girl like she was kind of my only friend there Like I hadn't known her before but you know a work buddy, right? Um, and so we were doing like this work together And she was like, hey, can I ask you a question? And I was like, yeah, what's up? And she was like, what's your star sign if you know? Uh, your, your zodiac sign and I was like, oh my zodiac sign. It's uh, And then she's like wait before you say that you're a Virgo, right? You totally could give me, like, Virgo vibes. I, I absolutely know that you're a Virgo. And I'm like, I'm actually a Taurus. <laughs> she was like, oh, you're a Taurus? That's so crazy. You don't give me Taurus vibes at all. And I was like, oh. And, like, I was just like, oh, how? Oh, I think I was like, oh, wow, or something like that. That's crazy. Why do you think I was Virgo? And, like, I forget what she said, but she was like, yeah, because, like, Taurus, it says they're very materialistic and blah, 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 blah. And I'd, like, never heard that before. <laughs> Because, like, all the tourist things that I would see is, like, oh, you're kind, you're caring, you're down to earth, and for some reason you're just, like, insatiably hungry. Which I don't all that, I don't, I don't really agree with all that much. If anything, I have trouble getting appetites nowadays. Hold on, my nose is itchy. And there's no way to pause it on my controller. Ugh. Goddamn. So close to a sneezy Rico right there. There we go. Locked in. But yeah, I don't know, I kind of, like, not that I hate, like, oh, anyone who does astrology is stupid, you know? No, I think it's fun every now and then to be like, okay, what do you, what do you say my day is going to be like today? And it's just kind of like a way to see if you're right, you know? Kind of like, uh, like in the same way as yesterday where we were all like, oh, guess what type of clothing style I am based off my profile picture? Like, I was wrong 90% of the time, you know? <laughs> But it is fun to, like, see, like, oh, well, what's your thoughts? And then, like, oh, yeah, you're wrong, but, you know, it's fun anyways, you know? Yeah, that's the kind of thing with putting people in categories that only serves one function, which to answer early and insufficient information. Better to know people's individuals. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, that is so true. Turn, 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 turn. Damn, I can't- I can't get this quite right. I've been swinging on here forever and I can't get like as much of a swing as I could before. Gotta channel my inner child to do- to get those good swings. You know, I one day would like to swing like an entire 360 swing around the, the swing set or whatever, but also- what the hell? That wasn't supposed to happen. 
Um, but like, I kind of get, not motion sick, but I get scared. Cause like, if you swing to a certain spot, once you start getting like parallel to the floor, your swing will no longer swing. It'll just like fall for a second. And I don't like the feeling of falling. <laughs> I mean, much like a flat earth I respect, but I don't let them fly a plane. True, true. Respectfully. Return to monkey. <laughs> One of my personal mantras is respect them as a person, but don't have respect, but you don't have to respect their beliefs. The idea that you should respect people's beliefs is nonsense. Yeah, that's so true. There's like definitely some things that like I believe that my friends don't believe. And I don't necessarily like want them like, oh, you have to believe what I believe because that's the only way that friends are real. Because like, no. There's value in having, like, different opinions and stuff. Hey, up. Dang it. And it's just like, why would it matter if we believe the same stuff, you know? Like, uh, this is probably a horrible example. <laughs> I hope my friend's okay with me sharing this. But it, it's it's pretty incon- Kind of inconsequential. <laughs> but we were having a discussion the other day. I don't know what brought it up, right? And let me, let me make the disclaimer here. That's probably going to turn some heads. Uh, I don't like advocate for cannibalism <laughs> i'm not like hey let's eat people i'm not even like hey i wonder what it would taste like to eat people i really would prefer to go my entire life without ever having to experience that right but we were talking about this one news story that we'd seen where it was like this guy had gotten an, in a plane wreck or something and he had to i think it was a movie plot maybe and he had to like eat his fellow passengers oh here we go <laughs> Don't say that! Oh my gosh, but he had to like, like everyone had died and he was the sole survivor and like, uh, at, I think he was the sole survivor. If not, like there was like a group of survivors and so they had to like eat the corpses of not all the other people, but you know, like people there just to survive because at first they were trying to like make it with the food that they had. But then once that finished, like they were in a very harsh environment. They were like, yeah, no one's coming to save us because it had been like a hot minute since they got stranded. Was it the Boeing survivor? I don't remember. It, it was something. Um, and so, you know, like, they had to eat other people. And so we were discussing that. And she was like, yeah, I don't think I could ever really, like, accept someone eating someone. So, like, I, I would never want them to return to society, is what she said. Because she's like, I don't think there's a way to return to society from that. And I was like, I don't know. I kind of get it. You know, survival is survival. You got to do what you got to do. And welcome in Zozo Eclipse. <laughs> what a weird time to come in. This <laughs> one's but which isn't much, but yeah. Why are you talking about? <laughs> Listen, I'm talking about for extreme situations. If you're in a plane and you get stranded and you've been there for like, you know, months on end and no one has come even remotely by there, you know, so like you're probably not getting rescued, then you, you gotta, you know, do stuff. Shit. If I can switch over to the other one. Yeah, there's no way. Um, which one calls it? So, like, I understand in extreme situations, right? So, so I was like, I mean, I'd be kind of hesitant to do it, but I would totally understand. And, you know, I wouldn't be like, like, if my family... Because the, the argument that she made was, like, if my family members were on there, I wouldn't be able to forgive them. And I, like, would want to... I, I would not appreciate them being... Not necessarily unharmed is what she said, but, like, I wouldn't be like, oh, my God, they survived. You know, I wouldn't be really happy for them because they had to eat my my family members to do it and i was like well like but they you know they survived isn't that the good thing now if they're a shitty person then like that i get but if they're just a person i feel like they have just as much right to live as you know like your family member it sucks but you know it is what it is and so we were kind of like talking about that <laughs> i made this point of like well like if i were like to be in the plane and i didn't survive i wouldn't have i wouldn't mind like someone eating me to survive, you know, because I would much prefer people to live. And she was like, I wouldn't. And I was like, oh, okay. And I turned to her and in the most serious face I can do, I was like, hey, just so you know, if we're ever stranded in like very extreme situations and I die and you have no food, I want you to eat my body. There's not much fat on here, but like, <laughs> don't let me go to waste. <laughs> Is what I said to her. And she was like, I will never eat you. <laughs> oh my gosh. But yeah, I think that's my argument there. Like, the only acceptable cannibalism, I think, is, like, of course, in extreme situations. But, like, I would only accept being a cannibal if I were to be like, yeah, I wouldn't mind somebody eating me too. You know? <laughs> 
<laughs> Your friend obviously isn't a cat. Yeah, they are absolutely not a cat. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. <laughs> Listen, you gotta have the serious talks with them, you know, like, hey, listen, we're stranded, I die, I just want you to know, I want you to have a lovely dinner. <laughs> oh my god, again, this is not endorsing any type of cannibalism, except for, like, extreme situations, I'm talking about, like, extreme, extreme situations, okay? And even then, good luck with the moral dilemma, so, you know, that, that's my statement on there, I'm not saying, hey, go eat people, I'm saying, if there's nothing else to eat, and I'm dead... <laughs> Oh my gosh. But yeah, you know, so like you don't have to see eye to eye with everything that they say. Just as long as it's not like, like, oh, because you're like this, you don't actually deserve my respect. Like, as long as they respect you as a person and understand that like with even, damn it, even with your opinions, you still deserve respect, then I think, you know, they're a good friend. But Pep, you're a VTuber. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. There's not much like fat on the bones there, but you know. Whatever you can manage to scrap off, you know, have a good meal. <laughs> I'm struggling with a moral dilemma. Like, because the thing is, I can say that, and I do, I, I think I do genuinely believe it, right? But, like, if it came to it the day of where, like, I was the only survivor, and there were other people there who were, like, you know, just, like, like dead, and I was like, I'm really, really hungry, I don't know if I'd ever actually be able to take that step. You know what I mean? So, like, there's that. <laughs> Virtual bones. Yeah, we're, we're weird. <laughs> what the fuck are y'all laughing about? Uh, you know, just, like, when you have friends with different ideas, how it's okay to accept friends with, with different ideas. <laughs> and I am said friend with different ideas. <laughs> oh, man. Just a regular pep stream, you know? Oh, man. That's always a thing, like, whenever you stream, there's always gonna be people, like, just coming in. So it's like, no matter what you talk about, it, it's either you talk about a boring grocery trip, and they're like... They come in, and they don't see anything, or, like, you talk about the cannibalism story, and you're, they're like, Huh? <laughs> what do you mean, the cannibalism story? <laughs> oh my gosh. Right there. There we go. Let's see, we eat paprika, we become the new one. <laughs> Shush. We only say that when she's AFK. <laughs> she can't know our plans. <laughs> oh my god. Nah, it's fine. That, that's specifically why there's such a size difference, you know? We're just like different forms. Y'all are like the... The... What's it called? The before evolution? The pre-evolution? Pre-evolution of paprika? Y'all evolve into paprikas. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. You care for preparing normal? <laughs> Normally me everyone normally eats too. I decided to arrive here because my friend's doing a doo-doo. Doo-doo poo -doo. <laughs> Oh my god. Not the no-show. I'm assuming that's what that means. Doo-doo. Doo-doo poo -head. Yeah, it sounds pretty, pretty no-showy to me. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Sorry, so, so you're right. Well, eggs, you should eat them. No, only if they're stranded on an extreme environment and their friend dies, then maybe. <laughs> if you can bring yourself to do it, and you know, you haven't seen civilization in months, then I mean, you know, like, I don't know, because you will always face, like, I'm gonna say those people, but I don't mean like those people. I just mean like, yeah, you know, other people who will be like, why on earth did you eat them? <laughs> but you'll be like, hey, Hey, I wanted to live, and they were no longer live, you know? So, yeah. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, what the hell? It disconnected. Oh, that's weird. My little, like, streamer, streamer button thingy on my phone disconnected. That's weird. <laughs> I'd rather before I do to someone else. Right? Right? Like, I wouldn't mind being eaten, but I don't think I would be able to eat someone else. Because, like, you know, the belief is there, but then whenever it comes to doing it, like, I believe skydiving is, in fact, safer than, uh, what was it? Car rides? Because there's, like, statistics to prove that. But, you know, whenever it comes to hopping in the car, it's much easier for me to do that than, you know, go skydiving, so. <laughs> and not even with the cause, I'm talking about just, like, you know, actually doing it, so yeah. Yep. Oh, god damn it. Dang it. Let's see, he messed with me first. 
to hand out. I responded a couple minutes late, and now he's unresponsive. Like, bro. Oh, I can answer that actually. You know how like people are like, oh, he messaged me first, and now he's like not even there. Where did you go, bro? I can answer that. We forgot you. We messaged you. <laughs> we forgot we messaged you. That or like. If they think you're really cool and they're kind of like me, then they'll be like, Oh man, they're really gonna say no! Oh no, they're gonna say no! And then they decide, like, not to respond. Because they're like... Like, after they send the thing, like, that they hype themselves up to send. Then they're like, okay, there, I did my thing. And they kind of forget that they have to wait for a response. And so then they leave it. And they go to, like, somewhere else to, like, do other stuff. And then that, because, like, I've done that <laughs> multiple times to people. <laughs> I'm not gonna say I'm, like, a bad friend, but I'm a bad sociable friend, you know? Like, I'm bad whenever it comes to- fuck. Whenever it comes to, like, social stuff. Where it's, like, you know, continuing conversation and being- <laughs> co Not communicative. Because I am communicative. It's just a matter of, like, actually getting me to talk. Mainly on text. And face-to-face, -face, I think I'm much better at it. As long as we're already friends. So it's, like, really, really difficult for me to be- <laughs> friends with people because like in person if I don't know them too much then it's like oh I'm shy and I don't want them to immediately think that I'm weird even though like I know damn well that I'm weird but like not everyone is accepting of my type of weird so I don't want them to like I don't know beat me up or something <laughs> but then online I'm like I don't know them and like they could be I don't know oh crap they could be like a scary person you know and so I'm like even more untrusting but then once I like I get to know them in person after an extended period of time, then I'm like super not clingy kind of a little bit online. But then like I'll I'll worry that like maybe I'm being a little too much and then I'm like, I don't want them to like not like me. <laughs> so like, I'll reduce the amount of times that they see me. Oh man. It's really bad. I'll want to see them, but then I'm like, what if what if they don't want to see me? And yeah, like and to be fair, like, I feel the exact same way with my best friend. Like, she's like, yeah, you know, we're best friends. Like, you're you're the best friend that I have. And I'm like, and I'll be, like, always worried. Like, what if she thinks I'm not cool? <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's just a me issue. It's definitely a skill issue. No beating Peppa up. Wait, grabs rubber chicken. You heard it, folks? We beat Peppa up. No, I'm just saying I'm scared of that. Oh, I see here. This is a power grab. I will, I will, I don't know, become big pep if I need to. Big Pep, I will scare all. <laughs> I will scare all. You will you will fear me before I fear you. <laughs> okay, but sitting in a quiet room with my friends just hits different. Yeah, yeah. I know I'm good with them if I can sleep and I have any another eight people near. Yeah, I felt that. I felt that. Talk to my friends once a year. Same. I don't have like I think I have like two photos with my friends. And it's mainly because I don't like taking photos because they it always feels like an interruption when we have to stop and take photos. I like a lot more candid shots, but also I don't like having to pull out my phone and be like, oh, I'm going to sneakily snap a photo of you. I just kind of like, you know, as as we go on, then snap photos. But if not, oh, well, you know, <laughs> oh, man, damn, we can't defeat her. Wait, I'm actually involved. <laughs> I could, I could still be big despite the bonk. I could still be- I wonder what will actually happen here. Let's see, this will be a science experiment. What happened? Oh! Dang it, I just returned to normal pep. You've unsupered your pep. <laughs> Welcome in, Pally the Snake! How are you doing? Hope your day's going well. If not, I hope it gets better. Happy Friday! Yeah, today's Friday. I almost called it Sunday. <laughs> Mario rules in. Yeah, Mario rules. Big pep. Her head is the elephant that gets bigger. Falls over due to being top heavy. <laughs> oh my god, my entire camera roll is my friends. They see my phone too much and take pictures of each other. Aw, that's neat. Yeah, no, my friends don't. We, we all, like, kind of just... We feel the same way about photos to where it's like, oh, they're kind of a hassle to take if we want to look cute. And, like, we just rather them be taken as we go, but also none of us like necessarily... I mean, I like taking photos, but I'm talking about, like, artsy photos. As in, like... Oh man, I wonder if I still have that photo. There's this really cool photo that I submitted for this like uh, art assignment like years ago. And so essentially there was this uh, pencil sharpener that I got from San Francisco whenever I visited. And um, it was like a little train, right? Because they like little like, or not train, it was like a tram car. And so they like trams or whatever because I think that they have one tram car. <laughs> 
<laughs> in their whole city. We didn't even get to ride it. Oh my gosh. But um, but yeah, you know, they sell a lot of that. And so I got one of those because I thought it was really cute. And then what I did was I took like a photo on like one of the inside windows or whatever. So it looked like you were in the train car and it looked like really, really cool. So yeah, <laughs> I like those. But as far as taking photos of people, I like the, the scuffed ones. Like, whenever they're, like, in the middle of setting up for a pose. Because I think those, like, show their personality a lot more than, like, actual poses, you know? I have more images of my dog than I have of any family and friends combined since I was born. That I felt. I take a lot of photos of my cats. A lot of videos, too. There's a lot of times where I'll, like, I'll take a video and I'm like, Oh my god, I could share this on Twitter. And then I'm like, Oh no, wait, but it shows this. Oh no, wait, but it shows that. Oh no, wait, but it shows this. And so I'm just like, okay, no photo then. <laughs> No video. Oh man, I only have weekends where my phone is safe, my word. All it is is my friends. Oh, that's sweet though. Oh my gosh. But yeah, I can't imagine. I can't imagine. I've had my brother do that one time. He like, not stole my phone, but he took it. And he started like, taking videos and stuff and taking funny photos of him. And like, I saved them because I thought they were really, really funny. Because they're like the kind of fisheye lens ones, you know? <laughs> they were really funny. Oh man. I've been swinging here for like 20 minutes and I still don't know when would be a good time to like grab on to the next thing. Hip, 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 hip. <sighs> swinging is a lot of hard work. <laughs> I agree hard. Having people bring the genuine fun to a stop to pose for photos irritating as hell, yes. And the best photos are organic. Exactly, exactly. Like, if you want to take a photo, that's fine, but don't tell me like, hey, you know, look over here whenever I'm in the middle of doing something. Like, bro, just, just take the photo. <laughs> oh, man. Hip, 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 hip. No, no! Oh my god! Well, okay, we're here. This is like two steps down, I think. There's this one step down. Was this before or after the Roman bath? Uh, it's fine. You know, I would have preferred swinging there for 20 minutes. <laughs> control Z, Control Z, Control Z. <laughs> exactly. Oh my god. You hear that, guys? I think, I think I heard a tear fall. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. I knew when I was to swing because of... I tuned it out and then you reminded me now it's irritating. Yeah, I felt that. I'm the exact same way. I tune a lot of it out, but then like... Like, when, once I finish my thought, my brain goes silent for a little bit. Because it's like, hey, I think we hear something. And then it's like full volume and I'm like, oh my god. That. Hip. Damn it. Hip. Oh my god. Okay, hold on, let me readjust. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, maybe I need to go slower. Cause like, I noticed that that's what I did last stream. I just moved a lot slower, a lot more methodical, and like, who would've thought it paid off? Hip. <laughs> yep. Nope. Yep. There we go. Yep. Oh wait, I think I can actually reach that. There we go. Oh my god. Yeah. Gotta remind myself to breathe. <laughs> this is your reminder, put yourself in manual breathing. <laughs> oh man. Yep. Yep. Oh, I feel lightheaded now. Yep. Alright, hold on. Alright, hold on. I'm done climbing. I'm not. I just want to take some water. <laughs> oh, man. As someone who takes photos for a living, I also prefer not to stop and take photos. Right? Right? Let's see. If he doesn't respond soon, I'm gonna head to bed. I've done left him a final message saying man's dead. Manual breathing and blinking. Ah, oh, I hate the manual blinking. Because the thing is, I genuinely think that, like... I don't blink sometimes for a while. Oh, I need to close my window thing. Thought I saw a face for a second. It, like, scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> <sighs> mm. 
Yep, that was refreshing. You know, I will say, all the water in this game always looks like really refreshing. Like, I want to drink it. Company mandated manual breathing session. Yep, breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. <laughs> Hold on, let me close my window. It's not open, but the blinds are open, so. Yeah. Okay, I will take a munch of the cookies. The company mandated cookies. <laughs> Man, I felt like there were like Girl Scouts and stuff. I would love to be like an adult now, be able to greet them and be like, Hi, I would like a a two two boxes of some some moyas, some owls. Ran out of tea, Sag. Oh man, no tea. Dang it. The Brit the British are sad, the Chinese are sad, the the Japanese are sad, all the people who like tea are sad. Do Canadians like tea? I don't know if Canada likes tea. Does Arizona like tea? Because they have like the Arizona tea, though so I don't know if they're from Arizona. Why is why are they why is it called Arizona tea actually? And what's that other one? I think it starts with a C. It like oh, it does not start with a C. Oh, well, it kind of does. It's LaCroix. That's what I was thinking. Oh man, see ya. Bye bye. I used to be a Girl Scout too. Oh wait, I used to be a Girl Scout. Ah, uh, me too. They made me do like one craft whenever I was a brownie, where it was like <laughs> I keep talking before eating the cookie. I have the cookie in my hand, but I'm. I'm in the middle of yapping. Um, they made me do this one craft where we had to make like a little doll or something. And I fucking hated it because I did not feel like crafting that day. And they were like, oh, come on. You have to do the craft. You have to glue the hair. And I was like, this doll looks so stupid. It doesn't even look good. It looks so dumb. And I was so angry. And like, yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I'm just going to have a birthday party. Welcome in, Unimo. How are you doing? How are going? Oh. Hope, hope your day is going well. If not, I hope it gets better. Happy Friday and happy birthday. One, two, three, everyone in the chat. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Nemo. Happy birthday to you. Ta da! <laughs> Oh my gosh, we were gonna we were gonna pull out a cake and birthday hats, but we kind of forgot. <laughs> but yeah, happy birthday, happy birthday! What is it? Redeem claps, I think. Hold on, if I can do it before someone else re remembers. Redeem, dang it, I'm not typing fast enough. I think it's clap. There we go. <laughs> Let's see. There we go. I did it. I did it. I did it. Yay. <laughs> I quit at the end of the brownies though. Ah, uh, damn. I think I got to the one after that, but I can't remember what it was. Yeah, see? I knew it. People, people would follow suit. I'm like that guy who, not that guy, that kid who like, Pep, you should give them 12k for their birthday. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Oh. I made a huge fucking mess just now. Should have put the whole cookie in my mouth. Here we go. Okay. You know what? I don't know if I believe in democracy, but I believe in vote. I believe in voting. So here we go. We'll leave this up to faith. I'm not not faith. Fate. So there's one and there's two. I won't tell you what numbers correspond with what, but whichever number y'all pick, that's how much I'll give you anymore. Not that specific number, but like it corresponds to a number to me, not to you. <laughs> we can see Pep struggling. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm a roll for it. <laughs> you need to pick a number and I'll vote it. Yeah, you need to pick a number. Sway the crowd. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Stand up and fight for your points. 600 points to get. It's not actually 600. Unimo has said pick one. Everybody vote one. 
I see hundred percent, so it's already looking good, but I'm just saying it because I realized that I probably should have said it. Most unified we've ever been. We all did it. Mm-hmm. It's ending. Three, two, one. It's time to end. Oof, man. There we go. I don't know what we're voting for, but I voted for one. Well, Luca, welcome in, by the way. Happy Friday. It's Unimo's birthday, and so that corresponded with how much I was going to give them. And so number one was... Now I feel like I should change it. <laughs> one was 600, and then uh, the two was double that, so it was just a multiplier. Uh, two would have been 12,000, but I'm like, oh, well, what if I change it? Because, like, they didn't know yet, but now, like, I've already said it, so it's a little too late, but it's fine. 600 is still good, I think. Give 600 to at Unimo. There we go. Happy birthday! <laughs> the favorite redhead VTuber. Was it nothing? Oh, no, no, no. It, it, I don't think I would ever put that on there. Although, maybe, maybe. Maybe at some point I'll introduce, like, a third option where it's just like, oh, shit, gotta give zero points to 600. Oh, okay, wait. Okay, so it's the other way. Hold on. Give at... That's not at... At Unimo. 600. There we go. <laughs> Here we go. I knew it bloody accidentally said song or something. I just kind of said it because because the song, and then I was like, wait, that's the number though. And I was like, it's not 600 though. <laughs> but I knew, I knew it was a lie. Oh man. Pep, this is your command. <laughs> Listen, man, it's confusing. Yeah, baby. Okay, it did that's go what through. I've been waiting Let's for. go. <laughs> Wait, we're about to give her oh no i just meant i was giving her points but i mean y'all are more than welcome to join because you know y'all don't want to be the only ones to not bring birthday gifts to the birthday party <laughs> y'all remember that vine that was like you're gonna bring a birthday gift to my birthday party on my birthday with birthday party with birthday party. <laughs> and then they'd be like happy birthday <laughs> uh the good old days the good old days no you know this is what happens when people care it's so true so true though <laughs> The cookies are so sweet, but they're also, like, so dry. So, I'm scared to check points now. <laughs> oh, man. Saving all my points for when the economy crashes, I can train them for gold. Oh, so smart. They're going to be, like, Dogecoin or something. Does Dogecoin? Yeah, Dogecoin still exists, I think. I saw the other day a VTuber being like, Oh, I realized that I actually own, like, 0.4% of Doge. Which was, you know, kind of insane, I think. Oh, oh. Okay, good. Yeah. Gotta go back into focus. <laughs> Maybe I gotta hold with this hand and do it with the other thing. Yep. 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 Yes. Okay. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Yep. Perfect. Okay, all the green ones are fake, so we probably gotta go that way. Okay, let's see. How close to the top are we? I have no idea. I could probably find y'all rankings, but that would take a little bit. Because <laughs> I'd have to go through the giant list. Believe it or not, I actually legitimately do have a list of like everyone who's ever like responded to anything or uh, has earned points is what i meant to say stole a pen today why what type of pen is how far we are <laughs> i meant to in this game <laughs> oh oh okay i misunderstood uh we went down so you know there's that but well just now too we went more, more down but you know we're, we're further up than couple of the other streams, so there's that. That has to count for something. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm usually not too bad with the with the noise in the game, but the one noise that I will say that I absolutely hate is whenever you're, like, just getting out of the water, and then you dip back into the water, that sound repeatedly actually kills me a little bit. <laughs> Wasn't it a calculator yesterday, Serial? 
Oh yeah, now that you mention it, yeah, Kleptomaniac Serial is canon. Okay, since whenever I type a little face and Unimo's name, it turns into a cat. As a birthday gift, Unimo, just tell me a character you like, and I'll draw them and say, Aw, that's cute. Didn't feel like stealing this today until I found that pen. What type of pen was it? Is it a fancy pen? I hovered over that for a second. Yes. Because I like fountain pens. I have a glass pen, but I think I fucked it up. Because I think at one point I dropped it or something, and I think the tip broke. Because it has never really, like, worked in holding the ink, so that kind of sucks. I forgot where about- ah, crap. Fucking green thing, bro. Here we go. I forgot where I bought it from, though, so it may just be where I bought it from. I have no idea where I got it from. You right! <laughs> oh. Right. It, it was right there. There we go. This is a black pen. Just a regular black pen? It wasn't even a felt tip? Damn. What about it made you want to steal it? Let's see, let's see. I used to have a fountain pen, but then I lost it. Damn. There was this one coworker that I had that gave me... It wasn't an actual fountain pen, but it was like a fake fountain pen. To where like it had the tip of a fountain pen. But it was- it like worked the same way a roller ball pen would work. And it kind of like sucked a lot. Because <laughs> the whole point about, you know, uh, which, wow, fountain pens. The whole point of fountain pens is that you can do like a lot of the like kind of calligraphy case stuff, right? But with that one, there was like no way for the- for the tip to actually like separate and do the cool letterings and stuff, so it just, I don't know, it was kind of dumb. <laughs> but I still accepted it because I just appreciated the fact that she was like, hey, do you want a pen? And I was like, oh yeah, sure. Like, I was just so happy that they included me. <laughs> they were like, hey, do you want a thing? And I was like, okay, okay. I'll be a part of it. It was pretty fancy too. Ah, dang. Hip. It's crazy how, like, there's always an upscale of everything. Like, because I was thinking about it and I was like, oh yeah, you know how some pins like that are like $70 and stuff like that? Isn't that insane? Isn't that crazy that there's like $70 pins? <laughs> and then I was like, well, there's like an upscale to everything, really. There's like a cheap version and then there's, there's like the upscale version, whether it just be because of brand or, oh my god, or because of actual quality. Oh my god, oh my god, this fucking- okay. I just hate whenever you grab a thing and you pull yourself up and it like Like it just fucking bounces so much. That's the thing that I don't like the most. And I, I see this the most in the controller as opposed to- Because like if I, if I switched over to my mouse, right? Then you see how there's like a lot less of bounce? That's what I hate. That's the thing that I hate about the controller. It's just not good. <laughs> And it's not like the controller's fault, it's just... I don't know if it's the controls or what, but... It's just... Oh, crap. That was weird. There we go. I don't know why I had a ceiling problem this week. And that calculator last week. <laughs> oh, man. I was almost stupid as a kid because I didn't understand money yet and tried to buy a $200 pen. My mom stopped me and half went to some else and then... Then school. What? <laughs> Damn. Holy shit, not the $200 pin. I'm back. <laughs> you got this. Thank you. Hip. 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 There we go. It's been a while since like I encountered the, the slipping. Or it feels like it's been a while, so there's that. I'm gonna redeem the ones I haven't. <laughs> oh, it's been a while since we've heard that one, huh? What's a gasp? We get literally blown away by the two hundred dollar pen story. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, there it is. Oh, not the boo. Uh oh, wait. I think I know what that one is. No wait. Oh, yep. There it is. Okay. It's not the one that I thought of, but it was similar. Yep. 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 There we go. Wait, hold on. Ah, crap. It was all for nothing. Even if I'd grabbed the same fucking green one, then I would have been in the same position. Uh, I'm gonna use my mouse for a little bit. Just a little bit should be fine. Oh, 
That's one that I was thinking of. <laughs> oh man. Yep. Never said I was smart. Kind of regret it though. The pen was beautiful. Oh dang. Let's see. Yep. When I see the boo command, I always think it's the ghost boo, not the crowd boo, and I'm always just slightly disappointed. <laughs> oh my god. The only cereal I want right now is Reese's Puffs. Ooh, Reese's Puffs. Reese's Puffs. Eat them up, beat them up, beat them up, beat them up. Yep. Honestly, I was never a huge fan of those. I liked eating the chocolate ones because they were just Cocoa Pops. <laughs> yep. Yep. Oh, dang. You know, I never considered the boo would be thought of as, like, the ghost. Maybe I should implement, like, a boo but scarier <laughs> command. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Yep. Yep. Crap. I like cookie crisp. Ooh, cookie crisp are good. You know what my favorite thing is about cereal is that- actually, hold on. There's like crumbs on my chair and it's bothering the fuck out of me. But my favorite thing about cereal is that you can just put it in like a little Ziploc bag. Like my mom always used to have these little containers for all of us. And then she would fill it with like our favorite cereal or whatever. And this is like when we were elementary age, right? So like we were <laughs> like already a little bit older. It's not like we were toddlers. But she would fill it with that, and then those would be like little snacks for us. And then we would just like eat those, and they were great. And so the other day I did that again, because we went out kind of early, and so I hadn't eaten anything. And then I- <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I walked away from the mic, and I was just like, yeah, if I yap loud enough, it's probably fine. Um, but I, I filled like a, a little Ziploc bag full of cookie crisp, and from there I was eating. I was munching. The only thing is they were kind of stale. Oh my god, I hate this. <laughs> I can't sit down right in my chair. Nothing feels comfortable. Oh man. Here we go. Why do I just eat it out of the box? Ah, oh, dang, I couldn't. My mom would yell at me if I did that. So I would just... I would just get little containers or something and that would be our bowl. You know what we would also do? Hold on, let me turn this back on. We would also, like, we would get a bowl and we would fill it with grapes. And then we would, like, flood the bowl with water. And then we would, like, put our hand on the side of the bowl and, like, pour out the water. But also, like, our leave our hand there with, like, just a little gap at the bottom to, like, strain out the water. And then we would eat, like, wet grapes. Because you're supposed to wash them, right? So that's how we would wash them. And then, like, we would eat that. And I don't know. I just really, really liked. Because they were always in the fridge for us. So they were, like, cold, wet grapes. Which were delicious. And, like, I don't know. I'm craving grapes. And I'm also really thirsty. <laughs> Oh, man. <sighs> That's better. I mix, th I mix three cereals in one. Ooh, which cereals do you mix? I honestly can't stand mixing cereal. <laughs> I don't know why. Yeah, honestly, I can't think of any cereals that I would mix, and I'd be like, yeah, okay, I'll still eat that. Because, I don't know, I'm, I'm very picky. I'm like, ah, oh, I have to eat my Fruit Loops. Just with the Fruit Loops. I can't even mix the cereal and milk all that much. I mean, I've done it before, but I'm never happy about it. Oof, it's so hot. I say that, but I was cold this morning, so I got a blanket, so now there's like a blanket by me. <laughs> yep. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Yep, okay. And this one... And when it's back at the feel. Hip. Crap. Hip. Dang it. Hip. Nope. Hip. Nope. Hip. 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 Dang it. Hold on. <laughs> oh my god. I've licked my lips too much, so I gotta... They hurt. I got... I got fucking... Never mind. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Just hold on. Give me a second. Let's see. My mom would yell at me too, so I did my room with a box of cereal, just eating it in the corner or something. That I felt. Oh my god. My personal favorite cereal is cereal... 
No, is that Toast Crunch cereal? Cinnamon Toast Crunch and Reese's Puffs. Ooh, those are good. Well, I don't know about the Reese's Puff, but the Cinnamon Toast Crunch is really good. Whenever I want to watch a show, I can't. Like, the app is on paid or something. I have a reaction. I can slowly piecing each thing together. Oh, I see what you mean. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Raisin Bran, Fruity Pebbles, and some Kellogg's type of corn wheat. Corn wheat and almond. Ooh, that does sound like a really good blend. Let's see. I like to watch person react to the whole series and next and the next. <laughs> uh, crap, I worried about it. Can we start streaming from scratch? No. <laughs> oh my god, a goblin, that guy. Crouching over a box of cereal is certainly a mental image. Does banana flavored chocolate taste like banana or chocolate? Banana flavored chocolate or do you mean uh, chocolate covered banana? Because banana flavored chocolate. It would taste like banana. Or it would taste like chocolate, but like with a little bit of banana. Man. I'm so bothered right now. There's like little sensory issues. <laughs> they're like not even that big of a deal, but like they're bothering me enough to where I'm like, okay, hold on. Let me just fix this really quick. Oh, man. See, this question made no sense. No, it does. It does. Because it's like those, those like, uh, what is it? Mint flavored chocolate and stuff like that. So I think it, it actually more, it, it does more than you think. Yeah. I wonder what else I, I, you should not steal anything from school anymore. Oh, man. I was a little gremlin as a kid. I think we all were. Well, actually, no, that's not true. There are like some rare people every now and then that they're like, oh, yeah, I didn't do anything bad as a kid. And it's like, how did you, how? Welcome in, Scenery King. How are you doing? Everybody's going well. If not, it's better. Happy Friday. There we go. There, I said hi. Calm down. Calm down. A little too much energy. We're climbing. Gotta save the energy so that way we don't lose grip. Hey, yep. Where is it? Nope. Here. Nope. Most banana flavor stuff doesn't even taste like banana to me. Yeah, because the artificial flavor of banana is not like... It, it's not the same as like actual banana because it doesn't use bananas because <laughs> it was intended for something else i don't know there's like a whole story there i remember reading it it was either in a video or it was like one of those like state testing uh stories things that they would make you read and be like oh we're testing your comprehension did you actually understand what you just read <laughs> oh crap hold on hold on right there there we go let's see i don't go anything but getting a verbal fight and I didn't even start it, huh? I wonder if I should take a whiteboard or even just a marker or even someone drink again. Maybe you should just like stop stealing stuff, maybe? Just like a thought, cause you know, I don't think people would appreciate it. And I don't think you would appreciate it if people stole your stuff, but like at the rate that you're going at, isn't your stuff really your stuff? <laughs> oh man, I remember one time I had like this giant pencil. Y'all you know those like, those giant pencils that they give garden gardeners, kindergartners. Yeah, baby. That's I've returned. Went. Welcome back, Hell Diver. How are you doing? Up today's going well. If not, it's better. Uh, if I grab that, I'll fall. How did I do it last time? Yeah, no, it's, it's definitely fake. Um, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, uh, the like my first pencil or something like that, and it's it's like literally just a giant pencil. Well, my mom would get us those because they actually last really, really long. And so she would buy that and the sharpener for it. And then that would be our pencil for a long time. And we, we liked it. I enjoyed it personally because it felt like fun to carry around. And then it like genuinely did last a long time. So I didn't have to worry about, you know, really sharpening it too much or anything. So I enjoyed it a lot. Um, and then one day, like I, I found out that I could like peel off the like first layer of paint on the pencil. And then from there, I could write my name on it. And so, like, then I had, like, a personalized, labeled uh, pencil, right? And it was really neat. And then <laughs> one day in science class, I forgot it. And I was like, ah, oh, shit, I lost my pencil. Damn it. And so I was like, dang it, you know, like, oh, my fucking pencil. And then I think the next day I went to a class. Because, like, I didn't even notice which class that I'd lost it in. But the next day in science class, the kid that sat next to me... He was writing, and I, I just happened to, like, look over, and I see that he's writing, like, with, like, my, my big pencil. And I know it's my big pencil, because, one, I'm the only one who has that pencil, right? And, two, it literally said my name on it. 
but I felt kind of awkward. I was like, oh, well, <laughs> I don't want to accuse him. Like, you stole my pencil because you're a thief. You know, I didn't want to do that. But I also, like, I wanted my pencil back. So I was like, fuck. And so I was like, hey, where'd you get that pencil from? And he was like, oh, I found it on the floor. And I was like, hey, I think that's my pencil. He's like, what do you mean? And I was like, it says my name on it. And that's the pencil that I had yesterday. And he was like, oh, shit, my bad. And I was like, no, 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 don't worry. Thank you. And then he gave it back to me. And then, like, that's it. <laughs> but, like, it was so embarrassing. I don't know why, because, like, I owned it. There shouldn't be anything embarrassing about it. Is the screen glitching or am I glitching? I think, like, legit, some of the pixel, some of the pixels on the screen are glitching. Does it capture it? If it captures it, then it's the game. Nope, that's me. That's all me, baby. <laughs> that's my screen. Oh, shit. Let's see. They stole my balloon. Oh, no. You have a pencil like that, though, the size of my forearm. Yeah, they're nice, right? Well, like, not the comically huge ones, right? Like, not the super big ones, but, like, the the thick ones, you know? Like, the, the kindergarten baby pencils. Out of a cues, bro. <laughs> oh, man, she kept, she kept stealing a bit ago from what I saw. Yeah, you're glitching cray-cray. Nah, you don't even, like, don't even know, man. It's, like, literally some of the pixels will kind of, like, start glitching in certain ways to where they look like lighter and you can see kind of like the pixel divisions and it's worrying me because like I don't want my computer monitors to go out anytime soon <laughs> oh man it would be a struggle to have to like you know do anything about them have a phone for my birthday pog upgrades people upgrades yeah. <laughs> <Delu. laughs> dang it oh oh that's a concussion I said earlier that it's your birthday. If this is true, happy birthday. Yeah, yeah, it's Unimo's birthday. Oh, I just dropped something. Oh, it is so hot. Holy shit. Here we go. He yep. Oh, oh, oh. I wanna go swimming. <laughs> With the fucking heat. And then the sounds of the swimming pool, my brain's like, oh, I want to go swimming. I don't even know how to fucking swim. I just want to get in water. I got that frog urge. <laughs> Sun and... Whenever I say this one, there's like a certain way that I say it sometimes that reminds me of like a lot of my uncles when they'd be like, eso, you know? So, yeah, I don't know. I just wanted to point that out because I thought of it. <laughs> Froggers, exactly, exactly. Speaking of birthdays, it's something you shared. When's your birthday, Pep? Uh, it is May 11th. I will actually not be streaming on my birthday because I found out I will be out of country <laughs> on my birthday, which is, you, you would think would be like, oh, that's so cool, you're going traveling? See, here's the thing. I think I mentioned this before. I don't want to because I'm not like I'm, I don't like surprises, but I just don't like it from people that I don't know or like, that aren't too familiar with me um and so i'm gonna be visiting like my grandparents and stuff it's gonna be like during that week that i'm gonna be out of town so there's probably gonna be like scheduled posts or something around that time so i probably more than likely if i get caught up with my stuff now <laughs> there'll be stuff posted regularly so don't worry i won't disappear completely from y'all's minds I, I will never allow that um probably <laughs> But yeah, like I'm gonna be there and I don't know if my dad really knows this yet that, you know, my birthday's gonna happen while we're over there and I kind of haven't brought it up like at all because I'm scared because I don't want them to celebrate it because I'm scared that like they'll bring a cake that I don't like or like, you know, something like that. And I don't want to be ungrateful, but I'm just like, oh, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to have to worry about like, oh, I don't want to seem ungrateful, but I don't want this. I remember one time, uh, my grandma not the same grandma, but uh, my grandma from the other side of my family, she got me like a kit of makeup for my birthday. And then during my 15, uh, they got me like a, a curling iron, which I mean, don't get me wrong, like, you know, great and all, I, you know, enjoy being thought of at all. But I had never done makeup, did not care about styling my hair. So it was just kind of like I had these things and I had nothing to do with them. Like, I, you know, didn't use makeup and I didn't know how and I was not in the mood to like learn how to do it because I like the way I look, 
without and i'm not being like oh i'm not like a good girl like literally just i'm too lazy to really learn too much about that and most i know how to do eyeliner and that's about it but like i didn't i don't know i, I didn't care for it and so that just kind of sat there i ended up using it as paints um and then the curling iron my, i ended up giving it to my mom because she was like oh can i use this and i was like yeah sure go ahead and so she still has it to this day and so it's just like oh i don't want to have to deal with that <laughs> Three more days until my birthday. Yo, Pa, close birthdays. Our birthday's on May 14th. Let's see. The day I have a concert. Yo, it's cool. I hope it's a fun trip. Yeah, me too. Or tell them, no, because, because, like, what if they're like, no, but we have to, like, celebrate it. And then it makes it even more awkward because then I feel like, like, I'm being like, hey, you're not allowed to celebrate my birthday. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to offend them, but also, like, uh, I don't, I don't want to, like, I don't want to be perceived as like, oh, ungrateful yeah. or like, oh, rude, you know, because I don't I don't like being that. I try to avoid those situations as much as possible. And by that, like I, I state my opinions, you know, I'm like, oh, yeah, I don't want that because I've tasted it before and it tasted bad. Oh, I don't like that because I don't like the flavor. Oh, I don't like that because of a reason that I have. And they're like, oh, well, you should try it because you've never tried it. And it's like, oh, my God, I've tried. We have these we have had this exact conversation before and you never listen. And so we just like get to that, and I'm like, oh, I don't, uh. so yeah. <laughs> but this time my hair is just long. It's pretty much that's it. I felt that. Oh man. So I responded two minutes, tag me in Discord. <laughs> like our concert or people sing orchestra concert. Ah, I see, I see. Yeah, like a friend's orchestra, or is it like an actual orchestra and stuff like that? Because, like, there's school orchestra, and then there's, like, you know, the Legend of Zelda orchestra, which are, I feel, no offense, but two very different levels of stuff. Because one's, like, I'm there for my friend, and the other one's, like, I'm here because I enjoy it, and this is a beautiful piece of work that will affect me for <laughs> years to come, you know? Yep. 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 Ooh, family being silly, then. Yep, they're being silly. It's just, like... It's it's really only one, one, yeah. and the rest, like, I'm sure they wouldn't, like, you know, care too much, or not care too much, but, like, yeah. be too on it. Like, I'm lucky enough to where, like, the family members that I do have around me, not, yeah. like, necessarily were, like, super close, and, oh, I could just easily tell them it's really just, like... I'm pretty sure they won't react that way, but also they might think it, and, like, because of that, I don't want to- I don't want to affect their opinion of me, because, you know, that people please are in me a little bit. Because, like, people who I don't have to interact with too often, I don't- like, I would prefer them to have a good, uh, whatchamacallit, it? like, a good opinion of me, but also I'm not gonna, like, bend over backwards to have that, you know? So, like, it's just like, ah, oh, man, this will have lasting consequences, but also I probably don't care a whole lot about the consequences. Yep, there we go. I have a band, con band, bleh, band concert in which I am playing the trumpet. Oh, and I'm scared out of my mind that I'm going to screw up. Do you have a solo? Or are you just playing the trumpet? I mean, honestly, you'll probably be fine as long as you practice, then you should be fine. What I always used to do for band and stuff, I realized it's the same way that, like, I ended up learning the song in that one experiment. You just, like, keep doing the same thing the same piece over and over until you don't mess up during practice. And then from there, you just do what you did during the concert. Yeah. I don't know. I used to like, not used to, I enjoy music. And when I was in band, I used to like enjoy being a part of the, a part of the music. How the fuck did I do it last time? So like, that's why I just, I don't know. I focused on that. There was like one time that I messed up and it was so funny. The time that I did mess up, um, I fucked up the entire band because I was on snare drum that time because <laughs> I was a percussionist and so um, When I fucked up if it like confused the bass drum person which then confused the rest of the percussion people which then confused the bat the brass section then the Was it then it was the woodwinds and then it was like the other section. I forget what other section we have um, and like <laughs> It sounded like like a train wreck. It was genuinely funny. It sounded like so comical. Uh, but and it it was like not even like oh we were in front. Wait, was it? 
It was during a performance because I, I was thinking for a second. I was like, wait, was it that time that we went to competition? No, it was it was like a performance in front of like all our parents and stuff. And so it was like a little embarrassing in that moment because like what had happened was that I was kind of like zoned in because I was like, yeah, you know, it's fine. I just do what I normally do. And I did not focus enough to actually pull that off. So like I kind of zoned two out and then lost where I was and then played one measure ahead. And then when I realized, wait, I don't think this is quite right. Then I was completely lost and then I fucked up everyone around me. But yeah, oh man, currently on snare. Oh, <laughs> well, just know that like, if even if you do mess up, wait, I thought you were playing the trumpet. Oh no, wait, that was, that was, uh, ba 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 TF2, TF2, what? Was it TF2? No, it's Helldiver. Helldiver is playing the trumpet. And then that guy is playing snare. Ah, do you like snare? I like the snare. Let's see. It was my favorite piece to, favorite instrument to be on. Hold on, now I gotta read. Let's see. Not a solo, but I'm scared if I screwed up, I will mess up the entire band, but I do like the music that we were playing. Ah, okay, then don't worry about it too much. Even if you do mess up, it'll just be like a funny story to tell years down the road. And like, I didn't even get yelled at that day. <laughs> like, not even the, the band instructor gave me a disappointed look. She was just like, yeah, okay, you know, that happens sometimes. Don't worry too much about it. And, you know, th there will always be more performances. So, it's okay. King Chana, King Chana. <laughs> it's fun, right? There we go. There we go. When I was little, I fell down the stairs and it hurt. Yeah, because that wasn't a very good story. <laughs> It's just there was no impact. Where was the emotional journey? Where where was the motivation, you know? I couldn't relate to the character at all. So, you know, not very entertaining. Gonna give it a, a 2 out of 5 on Yelp. What's the Yelp of, of books? Isn't it like Goodreads? I think that's what it is. I never understood the website of Goodreads. I think it's for reviews, but honestly I'm not too sure. It's kind of just like a Wikipedia, but it doesn't even like tell you that much about the books. It's just kind of useless, I think. In fact, was it? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! That's <laughs> when I was three, I fractured my skull. What is wrong with y'all? Y'all had eventful lives. I had no bones break. So far, I've not had any bones break. Um. Honestly, I was I was a pretty safe kid, and I was rambunctious as a kid, so I don't know, that's just a skill issue, I think, on y'all. One time I had beef with Spider, and we started throwing hands. The end. Who won? That's not the end. Who won? That's the end. Hep, hep. The real fight was the friends we made along the way. <laughs> ah, damn it. Okay, I grabbed it that time, but because of the force. How the fuck did I get up there last time? Oh my god. One time as a kid, I fell off the bed. Ah, same. But that was like multiple times. I used to wrestle with all my siblings and we would like throw each other off the couches and stuff. It was fun. Never broken a bone either. Fingers crossed. Right? Right? <laughs> Last time I did any close to a solo, it was during Veterans Day concerts. I was one of the two people that was supposed to play taps. The other person was my best friend. I screwed up. Have you screwed up like a bunch of other times? Because then maybe that would explain why you don't. <laughs> <laughs> but still, it's fine. It's fine. As long as it's not, like, during a competition. If it is, then, you know, just practice enough to where you don't, like, where you feel confident enough that you won't mess up. That's really the only solution, because it's not like, oh, you know, use this spell, and then you definitely won't mess up. Hold this crystal, and then you definitely won't mess up. There's no way to actually prevent messing up. The best thing you can do is just practice and, you know, get yourself confident enough to where you definitely don't mess up. But even then, it's not a total guarantee, because, hell, you know, I don't know, a possum jumps on your instrument, you're definitely going to mess up. But, you know, at that point, I don't think people are going to blame you. <laughs> oh, man. Smooth brain jumped off chair. On the towel head first. Jesus. Ran into a wall so hard, my tooth fell out. <laughs> it's already kind of loose. Oh, okay, well, at least I didn't get completely knocked out. You know, I chipped my tooth as a kid whenever I was at the mall. Uh, they, I don't know, it was one of those weird malls. They had, like, a bouncy castle on the inside. And my mom was there. Uh, because I was, like, out with her or whatever. And I was like, ooh, can I go in? And she was like, yeah, sure. And so they made us take off, a sh take off our shoes for the inside of the bouncy house, right? And I think I had socks on. And so, like, it was tile floor. And then we were running outside of the bouncy castle, which, like, yeah, skill issue. 
should not have been running on tile floor in socks but like I slipped and I fell and I kind of like you know like <gasps> as I fell and so I kind of I think I like hit my tooth on the floor and like it, it hurt for a while and ever since then I've had like a bumpy back of my tooth and it's like uh like I can feel the layers of my bone or of the of the tooth if that makes any sense and yeah I was at the age where like I had adult teeth like I wasn't uh, how to say it I wasn't like a, a whole teenager or anything but <laughs> like I was definitely a little bit like older and so yeah that was my adult tooth so <laughs> it's, I still have it to this day oh my gosh it's because of anxiety I was in front of a crowd which included my grandfather I was scared shitless ah okay yeah that that I understand yeah I usually I was never sure if my parents were gonna show up so I wouldn't really care too much and also I wasn't doing the instrument because I was like oh because my parents want me to and I want to make them happy I did it because I wanted to go on a trip to Disneyland <laughs> so maybe it's that maybe some motivation what's your motivation for joining the band oh man oh I need to sneeze <coughs> holy shit god damn Oh my god. Okay, we're back. Oh, that one hurt. Let's see, let's see. When I was eight, a metal pull-up bar fell on my head because I slammed the door forgetting about the pull-up bar. It was there today looking at it till it fell leaving, leaving one half, leaving a dent where my part was. Holy shit. Here we go. Why were you jumping out of bouncy castle? No, no, I wasn't that old. Oh my god, bless you. Thank you, thank you. Oh my god. Also, you need, if you're watching real quick before I say, okay. Let's see. But yeah, thank you. Thank you. This monster of a sneeze. Oof, man. Hep, 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 hep. How the fuck did I? Maybe I'm not supposed to be on the top. Maybe I'm supposed to be on, like, the bottom of it. There we go. Hmm. We need more adult playgrounds. We do, we do. Including bouncy castles. The only thing is like... I don't know. Well, no. Even as a kid, another kid falling on you sucked. Bro, there was fucking one time. It pissed me off so much. So, I was a kid. I was in a bouncy castle, right? At like, I think one of my cousin's parties. And like, there was fucking one of my cousin's... Like, it was dark, right? It was already dark outside, and so we were still, like, in the bouncy castle having fun. And, um, I don't remember if I fell or if I was just, like, laying on the bouncy castle or something. And then, like, I, I was in one of the corners kind of off to the side. And then one of my cousins came, like, kind of bouncing near me, right? And then he started, like, kind of bouncing in the corner to where, like, I was stuck in the corner. And I was like, stop, you know, like, I don't... I don't I don't I don't like it or something like that because like it was like I couldn't get back up right and like uh, not I'm not claustrophobic but I was like getting a little claustrophobic I was like can you fucking move and he wouldn't move and it would piss me off and so I kicked him right and then he went away and then like he came back a little while later started doing it again and then I like I fucking I knocked him down or whatever and then I got out of the bouncy castle and then a while later he got out too and I was like pissed at him and I was like what the fuck's wrong with you like why would you do that like not like, I don't know, I was just, I started yelling at him or something, right? And he was like, what do you mean? That wasn't me. And he was trying to, like, play it off. And, like, here's the thing. He was, like, a scrawny-ass motherfucker. I know goddamn well it was you. <laughs> There's no one else in our family built like you. And he was like, I don't know. Like, he was playing all stupid. Like, we were maybe 11 at most, right? We were not that old. But, like, I was pissed. And it still, like, gets me annoyed to this day. Because it's just like, stop fucking lying, bro. Just be like... Uh, okay, you know, just just fucking say okay. Don't be like, oh, it wasn't me, it wasn't me. God, oh my god. But then again, that cousin annoyed me a lot. Because <laughs> he would tell lies. He would lie so much. Like, I had another cousin who, like, we were all around the same age, right? He would also lie. But it wasn't like, like, it was at least, at least believable lies. You know, if you're gonna lie, make it believable. 
I'm not endorsing lies, but I'm just saying, if you're going to do it, do it right. And he did it, like, so, like, fucking bad. Like, he was bad at lying, and it was so fucking annoying. And, like, listen, I don't mean to hate on people, right? But he still kind of does it to this day. He, like, kind of like, oh, yeah, you know, like, he, how do, how do you say it? He thinks he's the shit. He's not even the fart. <laughs> no, but, like, legit. Legit, though. Oh, my God. But, like, I don't know. I just I just don't hang out with those type of people. Because they annoy me a lot. Because it's just like, bro, you're so cringe. <laughs> that type of cousin. That guy, are you a freaking cousin? Oh, my God. <laughs> that guy is actually my cousin. That would be funny. Oh, my God. But, yeah, I don't know. If you're going to lie, do it right, you know? Make it believable. I, like, think intricately about the lies that I tell. And I don't tell lies often. But if I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it right, you know? Well, my cousins weren't, like, four years old. Oh, uh, yeah. Yes, and definitely not me. <laughs> Paprika not four years old. Confirmed. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yep. Paprika, are you four? No, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, okay, that one is, in fact, not real. Now that we have that covered. That was painful to hear. <laughs> Let's see if you're gonna do if you're gonna do wrong do it right exactly i'm 11 teen years old <laughs> there's five duh yeah yeah i turned five the other year duh <laughs> oh my gosh yep yep let's see Ooh. oh my god how the fuck did i do it last time I'm so confused. I remember I did it, and it was, like, actually kind of easy. I was just like, whoop, in there. Oh, well, that's how I did it. Who would have thought? Hip. 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 Oh, hip. Can you just go up? Oh, my God. 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 And I was just about to arrange my hands because I'm like, oh, I'll probably fall soon. I should probably rearrange my hands. God. It's fine. It's fine. It's not fine. This fucking water effect. That fucking... Stop. Just stop it. It's... Water's not that loud. Kawusa. I had a biology teacher. Was it biology? I don't remember. There was like at one point that I switched schools, so I think I had two different biology teachers. But um the biology teacher that I had, she was like this she wasn't an old woman, but she was like older. And only felt like a plant lady, but she would always say like woosa, woosa. And like, I don't know. It felt like she hated everyone but she didn't like really take it out like she seemed chill but also she would like every class without fail woosa woosa and i was just like damn you really need to chill yourself out that often holy shit kids must be really annoying me also being one of the kids i would make her say that i was not that i was smart at least i was a troublemaker but i did my work you know I didn't make trouble that often. It's not frozen for me. Oh, yeah, it's it's not freezing for me either. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, did the echo end up redeeming? I didn't hear it. Let's see how it's working for me again. Pog, welcome back. Hey, yep. Yeah. yeah. What was I gonna say about her? Oh yeah. Yeah. That is just like I got reminded of that. Woosa, woosa. Something about it. I don't know. I think maybe because I imitate her, she had like a very calming voice. She had like a very mellow voice, like, hello guys, welcome in. Welcome to the class today. Today we will be doing... Moss, you know, something. And she was very calm and she'd be like, why didn't you do the homework? Oh, well, because I, the, my dog ate it. <laughs> Usa. Usa. And she would like rub her earlobe and she'd be like, Usa. <laughs> oh man, gotta add five eaters in case. Oh my gosh. I don't think the echo's working. It redeemed, but I don't hear it. Her 
Unless, do I have OBS routed to a different spot? No, I've been hearing all the other redeems. Dang it. Ugh, overshot. I rarely ever do homework. Honestly, that's valid. I was watching a TV show the other day. Why'd I say it like that? A TV show. A TV show the other day. And like, it was like, yeah, middle school grades don't matter. And the thing is they don't. Really, you could like do very average sixth and seventh grade. And then 8th grade. Then, um, you just, like, step up, you know, your work in 8th grade. You know, you get, like, really, really high scores. And then, come ninth grade, you're eligible to, like, you know, do a lot. Now, I'm not saying disrespect your teachers or, you know, be mean or bully people. I'm just saying, you know, grades aren't the end-all be-all, especially in middle school, Okay. I want to be very clear about that. Paprika does not endorse bullying teachers. They're just doing their jobs. Yeah, sometimes they're a little mean, and yeah, sometimes they're cool. It's a mixed bag. They're people. They're complex, just like us. Oh. There we go. Let's see. Did your audio cut? Or did you stop talking? Can you hear me? Am I still here? Hello? 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 Can anyone hear me? Hello? Hello? <laughs> like to okay, no, it, it says it's doing it. Yeah? Okay. Okay, so maybe it was... I can hear her. Okay, maybe that maybe the skill issue? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think it cut out. We can hear you. Yeah, you're fine. I was wondering too. Oh yeah, I know sometimes like, the thing is the mic has filters on it. So sometimes it kind of overloads and it kind of restarts and so it'll create like a, like a little clip or something. Like just now I kind of bonked the mic, so there's that. See, I don't think the echo worked, right? Yeah, it says it's redeeming. But... What do I need to do? Oh, you know what? I know what it is. Okay, give me a second. We're going to go into the void really quick. I think you can actually still hear me here. Yep, here it is. Who's it connected to? Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. There it is. Now it's doing it. Okay. Now I do this, and then I do this, and then I go back to... Uh, we'll go to here. And from there, I can go here. There we go. Okay. Now it's good. Yeah, because I think the other day I had, like, a while ago, actually. I had issues with my mic, and it just, like, it wasn't set to the default anymore. So it was probably just that. So there we go. Hold on. How much is the echo again? It was 100? I think two people redeemed the echo, right? Who was it? Use it so give two hundred at do oh there it goes. Yeah. And then who else? Was it Ooh Kalism? Ba -ba -ba. Who else redeemed it? Um Helldiver. Yeah, twice. So two hundred. I think that's right. Let me know if I missed anybody. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, hold on. I didn't redeem it. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Redeem. Uh, not redeem. Give. 200 to... Is it points then user or user then points? I always forget. I think it's points then user, right? Let's see. Come home from another banjo on my knee. Oh yeah, it's like, oh Susanna, don't you cry for me. I'll be back in Louisiana with my banjo on my knee. Oh, there we go. User then points, to me at least. Oh, that's probably why it's not working. User. There we go. And then points. Then give. That. Dude, you know, I don't think that's right. <laughs> yeah, I, I really don't think that's right. Oh, no, wait, it's right. All right, my bad. Sorry for doubting you. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, there we go. And it should work. That one did it. It works. Yep, yep, you right. You right. You right. I'm wrong. <laughs> Ugh, gotta readjust. Gotta do the daily 30-minute readjust. 
see y'all in the next 30 minutes when I have to readjust again because I get uncomfortable with how I'm sitting. <laughs> Redeem agree. Exactly, you right. Exactly. 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 Okay, and that one worked too. Oh. Made a cover of that song. Stretch. Another American Stretch. Pride song. I heard it. Loved it. Yo, Pog. Oh, okay, I'll stretch. And let me go ahead and get up, because I know y'all be like, Oh, you didn't get up. We were supposed to... Oh my god, I get to hang out with my friends today. Holy shit. Oh my god, I forgot. Every Friday I get to hang out with my friends. Oh my god. Because we have, like, those weekly notifications. Because we have, we have a shared calendar, a joint calendar, where we get to, like put anything that we're gonna do and so like i don't know i just <laughs> sorry the realization came out oh my god okay hold on <sighs> ow <sighs> oh there we go that feels better <sighs> there we go oh it's not redeeming yeah. now this Damn. is big brain time so much stuff is like weird. oh wait there it is it's not getting big though. Oh no, wait, it should get big afterwards. There we go, there it is. <laughs> oh no. It's been going off for a while. Pay up. Pay up. I cover that song lyrics in one of Lu Zuko's art stream. <laughs> Why Zuko? There we go. But yeah, I think the first time I heard it was at one of my schools and they were like singing people or whatever that came by. I don't remember what the presentation was about. Maybe it was one of those like, say no to drugs, you know? But um, they came by and they were like, oh, you know, sing, everyone sing to it, right? And there was this girl behind me that like I kind of didn't like. And so... I was singing, right? And then they went by her and they were like, wow, you have really pretty singing. And like, I couldn't even hear her and I got annoyed. So I was like, oh, I have pretty singing too. And so I started singing louder. <laughs> and like, that was it. But I like, I look back at it now, Waka. I'm just like, ew, cringe. I can't believe you wanted validation. <laughs> oh my God. Here we go. Yep. There we go. And right there. Right there. Wait, 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 wait. Touch yourself good. Yep, there we go. Do 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 do. Dang it. Why are you so over dramatic? You like overreach for everything and then you spin around like, oh, I can't reach it. I can't grab it, bro. It's right there. You reached past it. <laughs> Ew, I just realized I've reached the stage where I'm just starting to say bro to in front of y'all a lot. Oh, I was doing so good too. I was not saying it for a while. Let's come back. <laughs> bro. Bro. Punch validation kind of explains becoming streamer though. It does. It really, really does. That is it. <laughs> Shit! Oh man, that that definitely broke his knee. <laughs> yeah, great singing too, Buckaroo. Thank you, thank you for the validation. Thank you for giving me those the validation. Those like teachers can never give elementary pep. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, I'm not like too bad. I think. Not as in, like, school. I'm just talking about, like, it's not, like, a big issue where, like, oh, my entire self-identity depends on people's validation. Like, I appreciate it. Oh, my God. I appreciate it, but I'm I'm not, like, super self-reliant, so... I mean, no, wait. I'm not super reliant on it, is what I meant to say. So, no worries. King Chana. <laughs> King Chana. The foot hit the cement. Yeah. Yeah. It... His, his like, what is it? Shin bone would have been poking through his kneecap. It would have been bad. Yep. Into that song like five or ten times a day. Oh dang! You uh, have been a good <gasps> Yay! boy. Yay! <laughs> I forgot about that redeem. It's been so long since the redeems were doing the redeems. I think we went like almost this entire week without them working, huh? I think. Shit! Come on, man! It keeps slipping over nothing. Oh man. 
Doesn't he just stop? It's time to show one of those lovely houses. Because he has no legs. Could you imagine having to, like... I mean, yeah, already he's beating up his legs by, like, falling repeatedly on the cement. But could you imagine if he was, like... What is it? Dragging his body around on the cement? Like, that would be even worse, especially with, like, the direct sun that all this area is getting. That would hurt. <laughs> cat or dog? Don't yell at me, but cat. Or no, wait, dog. I don't know. It depends. It depends. I have cats, so I love cats. But also, like... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, I guess cat. I don't know. A wheelchair, maybe? But who's gonna get him a wheelchair? I mean, obviously he doesn't have a phone. He's been in and out of water and all he has is this loincloth and lets us wedge somewhere that we don't want to know. Then he's not gonna have a phone. Cat. Doge. <laughs> Wait, okay. Now let's see. What do the peppers say? I can't make up my mind. She owns a cat, but is a... Wait, I'm not a dog. I'm not. Cats are very lazy like me. Which... One question mark tab cat tab dog. Does Inter send it? Nope. Oh man. A turtle! You know, that's a pretty good response. Except turtles are kind of stinky. But then again, all animals can be stinky. It just depends on how well maintained they are. There we go. Squeeze tween the cheeks method. Of course. Exactly, exactly. I'm sure there's, like, tons of squeeze going on on his, uh, buttocks. Considering how much, like, leg lifting he has to do and how much, like, core strength he has to have in order to continually climb at this, uh, rate of movement. There we go. Oh. Yep. There we go. Your face can be stinky. No, your face can be stinky. <laughs> you can name a chihuahua a nuke and it can be the nicest chihuahua ever. But name a princess and <laughs> it's the deadliest dog alive. So true. I refuse to vote. I picked secret option turtle. So true. So true. We love... What is it? A person making their... Their... Oh shit. Their own way through life. Oof. That shoulder would have been gone. That would have hurt. That would have knocked the wind out of them. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna do it with my hands. I mean, obviously, I'm playing with my hands, but what I mean is, like, the mouse. Oh my god, I have so much shit on my desk. Why? I'm not- it's not- it's just stuff. It's just stuff. Before anyone starts saying stuff, it's just stuff. I just have a lot of stuff on my desk, okay? <laughs> I think there was, like, one time that I said it and somebody was like, Ew, what? <laughs> and I figured that, like, at the side. The side blunt. Yeah, exactly. It'd be like stinging for a hot minute. Hey, yep. Same to be honest, no judgment. Papers? It's not papers. It's like, like, look, I have a, a bracelet here. And then I have, I mean, y'all can't really hear this, but it's like a little UV light that came in like a digging kit. I have the controller. I have the keyboard. And that was my phone and the little phone stand that I have. And then I have another stand that has my face tracking phone. Then I have my cookies. Then I have a water bottle. Then I have... Oh, oh, oh my god. That water bottle fell. It didn't spill because, you know, I have it closed and I'm smart and I don't leave open stuff on my desk often. <laughs> and then I have an empty water bottle, which just went on the floor in a pile of water bottles that I take out every week because they're usually water bottles and we use them for like replanting purposes. I have a pencil, I have chapstick, I have a solder iron stand that I haven't put back. Um, I have a lot of stuff on the, on the side, but yeah. <laughs> Just don't look down. I can't help it. My, my mouse doesn't have a lot of movement. So of course I have to look down. So I gotta be like, oh, what is it stuck on now? What does it need now? So needy. Oh, shit. Here we go. Let's see. Do you have a plant? Not in my room, but I have one next to the window, on the windowsill. Uh, if you follow me on Twitter, you know exactly which plant I'm talking about. It's my tea plant. My butterfly pea tea plant that I'm growing outside my window. And we have a whole garden and stuff, so we do a lot of gardening stuff. Or I do a lot of gardening stuff. <laughs> Is there five Sprite bottles? No, actually, I am, like, very healthy. 
Okay, I'm decently healthy. I drink a lot of water, like just plain water. Yeah. Occasionally I'll put like a uh, juice mixes in there and that's it. But I don't drink like carbonated drinks a lot just because the carbonation burns me <laughs> a lot. <laughs> Cause I don't drink carbonated drinks that often. So it's a, it's a perpetuating cycle really. Dang it. Okay, I have to not swing so much. I just have to reach and let go. Here we go. I have headphones, a microphone, a door lock. But why do you have a door lock on there? A lantern, that's kind of sick. An orange, glue, my sunglasses, D&D &D dice, a mask, three cups, peanut cans, keys, drawing, mannequin, and more. Nice, nice. You got it decked out. Oh, crap. There we go. Got a decked out desk. Is it at least, like, do you have a little, like, empty spot where you can put, like, a sketchbook down? You got one of those desks where you have, like, a little square of space for, like, frequent use that you use? Desks are museums. <laughs> Is that so hot outside, right? Dang it! That was too much of a swing. Let's see. Oh. Hip. 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 Dang it. <laughs> oh, come on. Come on! <laughs> yes, okay, good. Yep. Yep. Nope. Nope. Oh my god. 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 Can you stop being so dramatic? Blech. 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 I keep drinking all the chlorine water because I keep falling because I don't want to grip onto the fucking rocks. Huh. I just want to- I just want to get up this spot. Is that such a crime? Am I really such a bad person? I gotta break out into song. How bad? <laughs> oh man. This fucking water sound. I hate- I hate this fucking water sound the most! <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Alright, okay, cool. Just a minute behind. Oops, still a good Twitter plug. Ha, yeah. <laughs> got it. Got to do the plugs. Electrical sockets. <laughs> oh my god. I oh, just become your steel. Your, your steel. Your stool. Hell. Oh shit! Echo. I was like, who's talking? They're talking like me. It's me. <laughs> so come back, Prez. Hey up. Hey up. It's so awkward sometimes whenever you're in a live stream. Like, not awkward, but it's just like, I don't know, it, it gives you that little moment of like, oh, oh, I feel kind of like a clown right now. Because um, whenever, like, like a streamer says something and you're like, oh, wait, I want to say this in response. We got a 50-50 on the dog and cat poll. So, you know, there's that. Let's see. It was me. I'm learning to do a you impression. Oh, my gosh. Luco, Luco Paprika off collab cannon. <laughs> Oh my gosh, but yeah, whenever you're like not in sync with the the streamer's live stream and so they say something and you're like, oh my god, that was so funny and then you make a comment about it and then like you put it in and you're like, why is no one else like commenting about it? That's weird. And then like, what are they reading? They're not reading the chat thing. And then like you click on, on the live thing and it's like, oh, you're like a whole minute and a half behind and it's like, oh. <laughs> so you like you get back and you're just like, oh. <laughs> Perfect response, it's 50. I mean, honestly, they're both lovable. They're both little fuzzballs, you know? Can't go wrong with either. Well, that's not true. I don't know. I feel like dogs are too energetic for me. Especially big dogs. Like, I like big dogs, but God, they just have way too much energy. I just... I'm I'm an EP. I'm an EP. Except for the times that I'm not, so I don't know. That's why I think cats are the best way to go, because for the most part, they're EP, but then they have, like, that, that predator... Like, oh, it is time to play. We must play. We must capture thing. You know, like that. And that's why I like cats so much as a pet. <laughs> as a family member. Hey, yep. Yep. Hey, yep. Yeah, and then when they actually read your message, they have no idea what you meant. Yeah, and it confuses them. And you're just like, you want to put in like another message. Like, I'm so sorry. I was behind. But like, you know that they probably won't read it. And you're just like, oh, oh. <laughs> and you just like let it die in shame. Oh my god, so I don't vote because you're all split on furry felines, so I picked turtle ultimate option. So true, but have you also considered the ultimate ultimate option, crab? 
crabs I feel like would make great pets. Do they? I don't know, they probably do. Honestly, any animal that you look up, you know, any animal that you look up except for maybe rabbits, you're gonna be like, oh, they're a great pet. That's not true. That's totally not true, but rabbits don't make great pets. As in like, because usually when you think of a rabbit, you think of like, oh, you know, they have like a little cage and they just like go there and then you look at them. Rabbits are so much work. They're like almost identical to cats, except, except like they're more destructive than, than a cat. Because like a cat will scratch up your furniture. A rabbit will tunnel through your wall. <laughs> like they're, they're kind of bad. I mean, I... I Whenever I had a rabbit, I loved my rabbit to death, right? Like, they were the cutest thing ever, and I loved them to bits. But, God, I lost cables. I, like, I, I lost bits of my walls. There's, like, things on my desk that, you know, like, dents in my desk. Or, what is it, bite marks on my desk. You know, just a lot. They were so cute, but, like, whew, crabbits, best of both worlds. I don't know. Imagine a, a crab being able to, like, hop and having, like, cute ears and a tail, but, like, hopping, you know, aggressively towards you. I don't know, that would be kind of kind of freaky, I think. Just leave in shame and never return to the stream again. <laughs> well, I return, but then I just, like, lurk for, like, the next month or so until I deem myself, like, worthy enough to enter the live stream again and be like, I, I'm here. I don't, I don't even make my presence known. I just, like, be there. And then whenever I think of something clever to say, then I'm like, aw, now I'm allowed to talk. <laughs> oh, my God. Rabbit zoomies are funny. Oh, they're so funny. I have a video of my rabbit, and she, like we so like my dad would get these uh paper bags from work right whenever he would bring home like uh food from work like any leftovers that they would have and they were like these giant paper bags and so i realized like oh they're paper bags i can like i can let her play with this you know because like it's a lot of makeshift toys for rabbits because a lot of the toys that they advertise in stores for rabbits usually aren't very rabbit friendly mm -hmm. And so a lot of the actual rabbit friendly stuff you have to find online and it tends to be a little more expensive right so you got to do a lot of like diy stuff um and so, like, I was like, oh, that'll work perfectly for her. So what I did was I would, like, rip it open into a long street, and she would grab it by the corner, and she would run around her little play area with it, and it was the cutest thing ever, right? I, I loved her so much. But uh, there was a bit of an issue. So rabbits are a little bit more nocturnal. Like, they get more active in the evening, uh, including early morning. And I'm not that much of a morning person. <laughs> So, like, it was cute, but when she would do it at, like, 5 a.m., I was like, oh, my God, please, please, shut up. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So, yeah. Yeah, but rabbits are great. If you, like, they're as much work as a dog, if not a little bit more, because of how tiny they are and how much uh, trouble they can get into. So, it's like, like a puppy, right? Because, you know, how puppies, like, they bite everything, they chew everything. It's like that, but small and fluffy, and they hop. But they're like so adorable and they can be trained too it's really neat i trained my rabbit to uh to to do puzzles but yeah king those are not rabbits rabbits eat meat rabbits don't eat meat go hate bunnies after you play five nights at right already you know what to decide the best pull between hyenas crabs who was talking about hyenas why hyenas dog personality i don't have pets i am a bit age uh, then you leave in shame. Cooks. Crabbits. Oh my god, rabbit zoomies. Ferrets. Ferrets are cute, but I've never owned a ferret. Let's see. Uh, the go-ahead bunnies. Let's see. You know what to decide. Okay, the poll. The streamer rats you have. <laughs> King, those are not rabbits. You say something clever, but then you realize you're once again two minutes behind and the cycle continues. Yes, exactly. Oh my god. God gives his most uh, cleverest comments to the person that's always two minutes behind stream. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Okay, I just have to reach for it and let go and, like, just hope. Okay, okay, all right, hold on, hold on, calm down, calm down. I don't think you can make it from there, King. So let's grab on to that. Close. There we go. Yeah. Oh, it's right there. Come on. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Perfect. A little bit more up. 
Right there. Perfect. Yep. Yep. The most clever comments being given to the person most behind on stream is like modern Greek tragedy. So true. Oh my god. I should not have cooked. I drew a crab it. Oh. I kind of want to see. Eh. Oh, dang it. Hey up. Hey up. Hey up. Okay. Gotta be double hand swing. Hey up. Hey up. I feel like it would look cute in doodles, but it would look like really creepy in IRL. Yeah, send it, send it in Discord. We all gotta see the abomination you created. There we go. That was a smooth switch. Hey up. Hey up. Yep. Oh, this one. I remember this one. Oh, God. How far back am I, really? Yippee! Yippee! We are a pirate. Yo ho, ba 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 this is the furthest you've made it so far? No, I was like way, way up earlier, but I, I fell. <laughs> I was... What part was I at again? I was by a bunch of... I was in like a pool, and there was houses behind me, and there was like bars and stuff, and I was climbing that to get up, and then there was like a sandbag switch thingy. So I was like quite a ways up. I mean, not too much, but you know, like a little bit. I was a little bit there, and then I fucked up. Dang it. Oh, I guess not. What? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> oh, wait. Okay, no. I, I I thought you meant, like, damn, sorry. I got super loud right there. It's because I thought you meant, like, oh, you weren't very far. But no, that means, like, like oh, you made it farther than this. So hot. I froze to death. So, Xana, don't you cry. Oh, I don't know what that means. It's probably a song lyric, though. Man, it's so weird whenever people, like, put... I mean, like, no offense, but... Like, I've seen so many people every now and then, they'll, they'll be in live streams, like other live streams that I'm in. And you just, like, with bigger people, too. And they'll just put, like, song lyrics. And it's not even, like, things that relate to the stream. They just random song lyrics. And I saw this a lot. Listen, listen. Has been Hotels bringing back the cring cult cringe culture, right? Which is great for the community in a certain aspect. But also, it is cringe. <laughs> it is cringe. I'm not going to bully those people, but I'm definitely not going to go to their hangouts. <laughs> And so, like, it's always a fucking has-been hotel song, and it's it's just so, like, oh, God, why are you saying that? Shut up, dude. Like, God, it's just, I don't know, you know that, like, secondhand embarrassment? It's that. It's that. <laughs> thought you heard that song about the banjo on your knee. Oh, is that where it comes from? I don't think I remember the entire song. I only remember, like, that little bit, and that's it. Because it was, like, years ago that we sang it, so I don't actually remember too much about it. In photography, sorry, in event. Why is it in photography? You Photoshop that or something? It's hyper realistic. Do you know about IITG? No, I don't know. What's that? Yep. Dang it. Just need to go up. I don't remember how I did it last time. Oh, dang it. Close. Close. I don't know where else to put it. Why didn't you put it in art? <laughs> Sad to release it into the wild. It's loose! Dang it. Hey up. Hey up. Hey up. Hey up. Hey up. Dang it. I'm right there. Hey up. Hey up. Hey up. Let's see. Second toughest exam? Uh -huh. How so? It's not art, it's a sin. Nah, all sins are art. <laughs> if I just died. Yeah, we're freaking finally be the climb for I did, I did! I spent a hot minute there. Holy crap. These hands. <laughs> yep. I mean, I can send it in Luca's server, but I want to send the song in July since it's a song about America. Ah, okay. But it's not July. It's very much still April. It's not even April Fools to be like, haha, I joked. It was I, I was joking, it was not July. <laughs> I don't get it. You have to fling yourself? Oh, is that how it works? 
Man, last time I just like brute forced it then. Oh, you know what? That totally does make sense though. Yep. Yep. Walgreens is out of pocket. Walked all the way in the heat for nothing. No! Damn, that sucks. I hate it whenever you go to the store and like they don't have the thing. So like, kind of related, right? Whenever we were getting the garden beds, we had to buy perlite, right? Which is a little white rocks that you add to your soil and it helps with drainage of the water, right? Because if you have too much water in the soil and it gets trapped too often, then it'll, it'll grow mold and it'll rot the roots of the plants that you grow, right? So we were trying to get perlite. We went to Home Depot and they didn't have it, right? And to be fair, the last time that we went there, they only had the small bag. So I was like, okay, that's fine. Um, and my dad was like, where else can we find it? And I was like, well, we can probably find it at Lowe's. And like, we looked up online and it said, yeah, that like they sold it, but it didn't say if they had it like in store. And even then, like y'all know with online shopping with like department stores and stuff, it's like never, you can never be too sure if they actually have it or if they're just saying that they have it. Um, and then like you go there and then they're like, oh, sorry, we don't actually have it, <laughs> you know? <laughs> so like I told my dad like, oh, there's this other store, the, the tractor supply that we can go to. And they more than likely have it. Cause I mean, their whole thing is about gardening, you know? So they, they more than likely have it. But the thing is it was like quite a distance away, you know, it was like 20 ish minutes away. And so like my dad doesn't like driving like more than 10 minutes. So like anytime it's a drive over like around or over 20 minutes, he's like, oh man, why did you tell me it was far? And I'm like, oh, but it's not even that far. <laughs> um, so like, you know, it was a little, definitely a little more out the way than like the other, the other store. And uh, I was like, oh, but like, they'll definitely have it. Cause we can go to the closer store, but there's a chance that they're not going to have it. Uh, but if we go to this one, they're like definitely going to have it. And so then we went there, right? We got up early and we went to the store the next day. Um, and when we got there for a second, I couldn't find it. And I was like, I swear to God, if they don't have it here, cause then my credibility would be on the line, you know, then like everything that I had said would have been a lie. Cause I like, and sure enough, they did have it. They did have it. So that was a good thing. But still I was like, Oh my God, please don't tell me they don't have it. <laughs> Only so much to lose if you fall. Yeah, that's true. We, we have theorized that Afrika is an old man, but she will never tell us the truth. What do y'all mean? I'm not old. I'm not old. And yeah, my age will never be known. I was around since the 1900s. So I'm not that old for a maned wolf, you know? Yep. 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 Oh. Why can't I... Why can't I spin? Dang it. I need to get good... Er, at spinning. Spinning and spinning and spinning. Spinning and spinning and spinning. Spinning and spinning and spinning. 1994. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know a weather boy? <laughs> oh, oh. Nah, Pep is like five. Five and a half. <laughs> oh, man. Hip. 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 Hip, 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 hip. Come on, come on. Okay, wait, I have an idea. <laughs> yep, <laughs> exactly. Okay, once this stops, like, moving back and forth, it should stay to where, like, the top is the, how to say it, like, the counterweight kind of area. So if I reach my hand up there, then it'll, like, it'll hold better and it'll give me more time to reach up to that mast. That was born in 2024 BC. I don't understand the, like, the year separation things. So I know there's, like, what is it? Ah. Uh, I know, I know BC is before Christ, <laughs> ACDC, Elemento P, <laughs> BRB, <laughs> I don't know what, what the other ones are, shit, I fucked up, dang it, dang it, okay, I know you're supposed to swing yourself, but like, god, that's so much harder, I'd rather do it by accident again. <laughs>
Uh oh. Oh man, let me not get on that end. Maybe if I get right on the middle of this outer rim. Right there. There we go. Wait one second. I'm doing math. What month would May be? It's the fifth month. Let's see. Pep was around when Jesus walked the earth. Listen, I'm not gonna say much, but... <laughs> who was it that I made that joke with? Oh my god. I can't remember who it was. But I think it was one of my friends, like, years ago, and we made a joke that, like... I don't know, we were talking about someone, and we were like, Oh yeah, they were in school when Jesus Christ was in school. How were they as a classmate? <laughs> AD is like, Anno Domino. <laughs> Oh my god, nah, AD is obviously, um, after DiGiorno. <laughs> the calendar doesn't have a year zero, so it's like 3, 2, 1 before Common Era, and then Common Era, 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh, that's so weird. They do like so many, I don't know, weird things with, with all the days and stuff. See, that's what I'm saying, time is a soup. Time doesn't really exist. You just, like, experience it. Schrodinger's time, if you perceive it, then it exists. <laughs> That's definitely not how that works, but it's fine. Years yeah. used to count backwards. That's crazy. Could you imagine if they still counted backwards? It'd be like, what happens when we get to year zero? Wait a minute, Paprika. Would I be, I think, like, one, two, three? <gasps> I don't get it. <laughs> or at least that's how we do it. Ah, oh, yeah, that's true. Yep. Society, society makes it one, two, three. <laughs> oh my god, just swing correctly, please. Please. Yep, 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 yep. So if I say 2024 before Christ, it's like the far off inverse. Holy crap. Wait, please tell me the year. I thought it was 1900. Yeah, it is 1900. It's American. Everyone's got an Uncle Sam. I don't have an Uncle Sam. Wait, actually, it might actually. An Uncle Samuel, I think. I think I've heard the name. I don't know. I have a lot of uncles, so I don't, I don't know. I have a lot of cousins, too. Whew. No idea. I only know, like, three sets of cousins, I think. And that's about it. Whew. So much family. <laughs> Pretty sure our year numbering was, in fact, done... By Christians, which is why year zero is the year Jesus was supposed to have been born, and it switched to BC AD. Oh. Huh. Damn. He was a really popular guy. <laughs> Imagine being so popular that, like, they changed time to, like, oh, this was before he existed, and this is after. <laughs> the before and after photos must have been crazy. <laughs> okay, hold on. My wrist is itchy. And I'm not making much progress, and it's been a hot minute. It'll be 123 years old. <gasps> I, oh, no, wait. I, I was going to be like, actually, I would be one. Wait, no, I don't think that math is mathing quite right. If it's 1900, and we're in 2024, but my birthday hasn't passed yet, then I would be 1024, no? Yeah, because... 1900 to 2000 is... I don't think I did that math. <laughs> I did not do that math right. Never mind. You're right. There you go. Look at you mathing. Oof. Man. <laughs> Listen, there's a reason I'm a main wolf YouTuber, not a math VTuber, okay? All right? <laughs> Subtract. That should be 2023 years old. <laughs> we started with zero. <laughs> I just had it was a thousand years ago. It feels like it, because, like, 19,000, you know? But, yeah. Unless I'm right. It would be funny if I'm right, and then, but I, I'm pretty sure I'm... Wait. No, no, no. No. No, yeah. No. Zo Zozo is right. Yeah, Zozo's right. Yeah, because it's 900. It's 1,900. I keep reading 19,000, but it's 1,900. You're not right. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god. 124. Actually, I'm 123 because I haven't I haven't aged this year yet. So, actually. 
Zozo has really good math skills, we've learned. Or at least better than me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, math class was always a struggle for me, low-key. I remember once I got to, like, calculus and stuff, I could not for the life of me learn anything anymore. Oof. I'll never forget, like, once we got to the lesson of matrices, I was so fucking confused. Like, I did not understand it at all. And I was like, oh, you know what? This will just be the one lesson that I don't learn, so it's fine. I just have to learn how to, like, pretend that I know it and get the answers right without really actually learning it. Because I didn't understand the concept behind it. I always need to learn the concepts behind things in order for me to understand, you know? Because then I'm able to, like, apply it, you know? But I never really learned that for matrices. And I didn't understand in what way it would be applicable. It just kind of felt like they were making up numbers and we were just like learning how to make up numbers and so i never learned it and then for the rest of the year we always did something slightly related to matrices and i was like i don't fucking understand this but the good thing is it was at like the final quarter of the year so at that point i'd already earned like a good enough score to where i didn't fail the class <laughs> oh man 1978 no uh, i know the feeling though these games the streaming turns the brain to pudding literally literally actually said that no i meant to say no it's not 1980 ah i see last year was the first time i understood math pretty much the whole time damn that takes skill oh, dang it dang it well sleepy time for me good night paprika and chat i hope the rest of the stream is good good night luco have a good night bye bye have a good friday today's friday i keep forgetting Oh my god, how did I make it last time? My dad in 1985. My dad. Yep. Thanks for the meat. I mean, man. Oh man. Yep. What if I just grabbed here and grabbed here? And then swung expeditiously. Look on his last stream that when, that he braced me. What? For 19, no, 1732, George Washington was a good school friend. Did you know George Washington's mom was like, Oh, my son doesn't love me. He doesn't give me money. He leaves me in the poorhouse. He doesn't send money to his mom and he's an accomplished general. Man, my son sucks, right? And he would do that a lot, and it would really tarnish his reputation. And he would get so pissed, because he, he would send her a lot of money, but she would just, like, like never acknowledge it. And so what he would have to start doing is he would bring friends with him to, like, show them, like, look, you see me. You see me giving my mom money, right? So you can attest to me giving my mom money. And it's a lot of money. You see this, right? And the friend would be like, yeah, I, I see it. Okay. Jeez. I feel like I shouldn't be here, you know? <laughs> oh my god, it was really funny. Yeah, it was really crazy. The Washington family was really crazy. <laughs> Let's see. I feel like we've been on this wheel for like 30 minutes. Yeah, we probably have, honestly. I can't get, like, close enough, and whenever I do, it's like... I feel like I can't reach out. Dang it. Dang it. Yep. Well, I fucked up. What if I grab this, and I grab this, and we just swing from there? I feel like grabbing onto one specific spot would be better for swinging it's a centralized pull point but i don't know i'm kind of desperate here so i'm <laughs> just trying anything see what works oh shit okay i can slide off apparently that was the thing i was prepared for so that scares the fuck out of me last time you held the center and then rushed to the top no swing right so that's what i was trying to do earlier but then it didn't quite work out hip 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 I think what I kind of ended up doing was like accidentally swinging myself up there 
And so, <laughs> just kind of like winning by mistake. Dang it. The thing is, I can't get myself up there quite fast enough. Yep. Dang it. Doing a little bit of a crazy thing here. Let's hold up both hands, it seems. Yeah. If I hold in one spot, then it's like stops swinging faster. Because then, like, all my weight is in one centralized spot. But then, like, moving anything will decentralize it. Hip. And then from there, it just spins again. Yep. So you're lucky. Maria's by stream. <laughs> she just kidnapped us, and then for some reason, we couldn't remember where who our mothers were. That's not true. Y'all remember who y'all moms and dads were. Y'all just, you know, also happened for some reason to be a pepper. <laughs> I'm totally not parasitic. No. We are one big happy garden patch, right guys? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I gotta go re-examine this wheel because we're gonna have to end stream soon. Like super soon, I'm already five minutes past. No raised by the spreading lies, he's a fraud. <laughs> yep. I don't know, he has facts that honestly I don't fact check so maybe he is spreading lies. <laughs> I don't know I just joined the club because I thought it would be fun and you know he made a really good video that convinced me like okay yeah I'll join I, I want I went in yeah I was I was in before it was cool to be a part of the anime and games research club I think that's what it's called happy 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 do 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 happy 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 Beats. Beats. Yeah. Best club for real. For real, for real. The VGREHC. I don't even know. Video Games Research and Anime History Club? That does go have a YouTube. Yes, he does. He goes by Prez Luco on YouTube and he streams and he does a bunch of shorts which are really, really funny. That, like, I recommend watching because I enjoy watching them. I always get them on my feed and I'm always like, Ooh, another Luca one. <laughs> they usually are pretty entertaining. How I found Luca was because they're streaming FNAF. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense though. That is one of the popular categories. It's one of those that everybody's like, Ooh, FNAF! And then they click on it. Yep. Nope. Yes, Luca is great. For real, for real. Yep. Let me up. Let me up. Come on. What the fuck did I do it last time? Okay, hold on. I'm genuinely gonna go look at the VOD right now. <laughs> hold on, give me like two minutes. Oh my god. I can't. How the fuck? Fuck did I do it last time? Uh okay, this one. Okay, and then go down. No, go back up. Okay, it's past the Roman part, at least. Ooh, it's past a lot, actually. Wait, no, it's not? Where the fuck am I? Holy shit. I'm at the pirate part. Which was... Before or after this? Scrubbing through the bottom right now. <laughs> Where am I? Wait, I climbed up. Oh, no, wait. Okay, wait. Okay, we're good. Okay, wait, here we are. Okay, how did I do it? Hold on, I'm watching. 
Thanks for your history in that name. It would be because of me. I'm considered a history teacher in the stream set. Oh, for real? What type of history do you specialize in? I found Pet Bia Shorts. So, wait, what the fuck? How did I do that? <laughs> I just got up. Let's see, I found Pet Bia Shorts. And then I saw she had a small VTuber. And so I found a stream. But pure coincidence. Yeah, that's kind of how it is, like, all in all, like, being online, right? Uh-huh. What? How did you do that? Wizard. Huh. Okay. Alright. Give you a hint. I was talking about it in your last stream. I have really bad memory. <laughs> I have no idea what we talked about last stream. Oh my god. I can't tell you how many times I've lost or gotten... Oh! Got my message confused. Not being used gray. What? I can tell you how many times I've lost or gotten my own message confused because I'm not used I'm not used to being gray. Oh, I see. Yeah. <laughs> used to being green then? Let's see. Oh, neat. Hell Diver. I thought I found her through redirect from... I can't remember where I came from. Bruh, I see what you're saying. No, that's not true. You probably came from the Queen. I think... Yeah, if I remember correctly, you came from Albion, no? Let's see. Blue? Why are you blue? Oh, because you're mod over there. That's right. That's right. See, I remember. Not a whole lot, but <laughs> occasionally I'll remember stuff. If I can get directly in the middle, that would be the most beneficial. So what I did last time was that... Was so insane. So I, like, grabbed on. Right. Like, kind of askew from the middle, actually, but I'm trying to get direct middle if I can. So like somewhere around there. And then I grabbed onto this side kind of if I can There we go. I kinda grabbed onto this side. Then I was like, turn the ship, turn the ship. You know, I was kinda like being dumb. And then from there I like went up. But it was like a lot stiffer than this. So it was probably like where was it? Probably like this one or something. Where I was like, Arr, turn the ship, turn the ship. And then from there, I had like switched hands here. And I don't know what the hell I did, but I like grabbed up and then from there I went up. That's what I did in the last stream. <laughs> oh man. Why is your head flat? Because she's using her neuron. So true though. <laughs> Something about cheese that made that name's man was Charles. Huh? Oh, Chuck E. Cheese! You're a Chuck E. Cheese historian! Oh my god! <laughs> I was so confused for a second. I was like, what do you mean, cheese? So why are you blue? Yep. Nope. Okay. Let's see. Welcome in, Imo. How are you doing? Updates going well. If not, it was better. Happy Friday. We we're past stream time, so the stream may be ending anytime soon, but. I really want to get past this part. <laughs> that would have been a good time to grab. I'm gonna grab like up here. Dang it. Why? <laughs> this is so difficult. Let's see. Yep, I'm the animatronic person. Ah, yeah. that makes sense. This is big brain time. Oh my gosh, I'm the animatronic person. You're, you're the purple guy. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm joking. I'm joking. Yeah, that's dope. Do you actually, like, know how they're built and stuff? Like, low-key? Yep. <sighs> Dang it, why can't you just... Why don't you just grab on that mask now? I know there's a direct center to be grabbed on here, and it's pissing me off that I can't get it. 
Unless there's not a direct center. Nope, that's not it. Nope, that's also not it. I'm cooking, but I'm burning it. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm enjoying Borger. I wanted to join like an hour ago. Then I was like, Borger first. And now here I am. Made it to the best part, apparently. To do... <laughs> to do... <laughs> no, robots and animatronics disgust me. That Elon Musk type stuff and the Disney type stuff. Wait, how so? Dude, they're too advanced for my liking. Oh, so you like the old ones. Are you winning, son? I am... I am girl Max Bailey. <laughs> I can't, I can't climb the wheel. Just make them cute, like Kerfus. Who's Kerfus? I don't think I've actually... I keep thinking of Rufus from Kim Possible. Dang it. If I just like scramble enough, it'll it should be fine. Probably. <laughs> when all else fails, scramble. Chama, kid Chama, what, what is, huh? Oh, King Chana, King Chana. That was... <laughs> oh my gosh, I've never actually seen it spelled out. Dang it, it's so. Oh my god! 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 That's what I've been scared of this entire time. Please, just let me up. <laughs> I don't know what to do. There's like no set. Like, I don't even know how the fuck it worked that one time that I did it. So, I, anytime I get like any progress, I'm just like, man, I hope I don't have to redo that. Because <laughs> a lot of it is just like. It's, it's by chance. It's by chance that I passed stuff and I'm just like, oh, oh, man, don't make me do that again. What's she doing? Beginning to believe. It's kind of painful to watch. In my defense, this is painful to do, too. Oh, man. It's just, it's not given. It's not staying. I just need it to stay for like five seconds and then I could do it and it'll be fun. And it'll be fine and we'll all be King Chana. King Chana. <laughs> Yep, yep. Oh, wait, okay. Get a little too crazy there. A little too quirky at night. I want it to stop spinning. Keep making it spin. What's that one meme where it's like... Like, I want to do a thing, but I'm born to do another thing? What's that one meme? I can't remember how it starts. But it always ends with like born to do this you know it's like like oh i want to go on trips with my friends from the group chats but i'm born to to hit save you know how does that how does it start okay Let's 
most of my animatronic lighting liking can be traced back to FNAF. My favorite show was has murder AI bots. It's called Murder Drones. Oh yeah, that one's the the two D animation one, right? Yeah. Yeah, I've, I've seen it. Or no, 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 no. I've not seen it. My brothers have seen it. Is what I meant to say. But like the original or the green what or the format in general. Wait, what are we talking about? Let's see. Pip, we've been on this wheel for like 45 minutes. Bro, I want to get off the wheel. I don't know what you want me to say. <laughs> like, I don't want to be on the wheel anymore either. I hated the wheel. I was going crazy. Oh my god. The last time that I passed it, I think it just had pity on me. Because I was literally like, I, I just watched the VOD. Like two seconds ago, I... I like jumps a little thing it was right at the end of the stream and i was like oh i'm, I'm driving the ship and then like i reached up jokingly and then i went up and then i was like oh shit that worked and i don't know how the fuck it worked i don't i don't know i just got lucky but i'm not a lucky person so it's just there to taunt me <laughs> oh 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 my god oh my god i almost completely let go the born to force to him. Ah, yeah, yeah. It's like, like born to plan trips in the group chat, forced to save or stuff like that. Um, born to to make it to the top of the game, forced to be stuck on the wheel. <laughs> oh man. Hey up. Oh, oh, whoa. Hep. 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 I'm trying so desperately, believe it or not. So I get the mechanics behind it, it's just a matter of like doing it fast enough and doing it with enough accuracy to do it. Okay, alright, okay, alright. Hold on, hold on. Ah, damn it. Hep. 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 Has anyone ever like turned off a ceiling fan and you get it to the last click and it's still moving because it was on? Because it had that like momentum and stuff and so you start putting your, your fingers between like the blades so that way it like slowly hits it and then it stops. That's what I keep thinking of whenever I do that because that's exactly what I'm trying to do. Trying to like slowly make it stop, but it's just it's not it's not stopping. <laughs> it's in fact not keen trying to speed run. <laughs> Born to speed run, forced to stay stuck on a wheel for forty five minutes. <laughs> Try doing that again. That's what I was doing, but it didn't do it. Just came back, like murder drones too. Yeah, they were able to watch a murder drones in the span of time. Not even that it took me to clear the wheel because I'm still on it. Oh. I literally don't know what I did. Like, I, I grabbed on here, right? And I was grabbed on to this area, right? And then I was grabbed on to, like, this edge area. And I was like, oh, I'm driving the ship. Do, 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 right? I was being kind of stupid. And then, and then, no, <laughs> don't boo me. <laughs> oh, my God. And then from there, I switched hands. And then I grabbed up here. And then I went up, and I just went up, and then I grabbed onto the bar, and that's what happened. There's probably, like, a little more, you know, things to be perceived, like, oh, you know, how was your weight balanced? Oh, my God. It was indeed Woo! fire. Yeah, baby! <laughs> That's what I've been waiting for. I don't know what's worse, like genuinely in life, when you know you can do something, but you just like are unable to do it, or when you can't do it at all. Because like one's defeating, one's just like, damn, I can never do this, you know? Like, I don't know, human flight without any help of any, like, instruments and stuff, right? That, or like, oh man, I know I could probably give, like, a really good public speech, but like, ah, oh, I could, I could just 
I, I just, every time I go up there, I fuck it up, you know? I don't know. I don't know what's worse. This is a constant pain that I struggle with, with games that require any type of skill. Because, <laughs> like, then I get close to doing it, and then, like, I fuck it up at the last second. Usually I still manage to come through, you know? Even this will end at some point, and I will have been at the top, or at the very least on the fucking mask, but it's just a matter of getting there that's like, oh my god, it's a journey in and of itself that is the most unpleasant thing ever. <laughs> that's not true. Yeah, no. Getting my, my, what is it, gallbladder removed was, honestly, getting the gallbladder was, were, bleh, getting the gallbladder removed wasn't unpleasant. Um, having it was unpleasant. <laughs> Troll Pep until she gets off the wheel. Oh no. Oh no. You know, I told my siblings one time, right? Because like, I was like, oh yeah, you know, it kind of motivates me whenever people are like, come on, you can do it. Because it makes me like really anxious. Because then they're like, oh, like they believe in me, but like, I don't know if I can actually do it. So it's really like frustrating. And it's just like, bro, stop, stop putting me on the spot like that. <laughs> and then from then on, they would always like, they would start saying that, and I would like genuinely be like, yeah, "Oh God, please stop!" Baby, that's what I've been waiting for. <laughs> oh no. Is there anything that tells you how much you have left until you reach the top? Nope. No indicator. Just, just free diving. Hip, 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 hip. Dang it. Hip. Just simply do it. I know, but the doing's not doing. Holy shit! I almost fell. Yep. Oh. 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 Dang it. I didn't even know how it happened earlier. But I wasn't, like, high enough to, to get up there. Dang it. Have pity on me. <laughs> I want to be cool like you guys. So you dress up like a horse? Have pity on me. <laughs> That's literally me. Hip, 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 hip. Did anyone? Wa oh my God! Did anyone watch Unis Honest? I remember that one video where they were doing like the presidential uh, fitness thingy, and then they were like, like Mark was like, oh yeah, whenever I used to like. I don't know how the fuck that happened. Ah, uh, please. Holy shit. Hold on. I'm genuinely in my happy era right now. <laughs> oh, okay. Hold on. Right there. Come on. Come on. Come to me. Yeah, yeah baby. baby. That's, That's what, what we're waiting for. for. But what I was going to say is, like, in Unis Honest, that one presidential fitness uh, video where Mark was like, oh, yeah, my coach used to, like, scream to me whenever I would start, like, you know, getting, like, bad. He would be like, Oasis, Mark, Oasis. And so Ethan started saying that. And it made Mark, I don't know if genuinely pissed off, but, like, he punched a hole in his wall. Oh, my gosh. Here we go. Hip. That one. I think of that one a lot. So anytime I'm struggling, I genuinely start hearing, like, Yippee! Ethan say, like, Oasis! Oasis! Yippee! <laughs> Hope. Hey. Yep. I want to get to the other pool, ideally. So that way I can, like, stop on a good thing. I don't want to stop in the middle. No, 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 no! My god, why? Why? What are we here for? Just to suffer. It was all for nothing. It was all for nothing. Life is meaningless. It's not true. You gotta find your own meaning. But it's damn well not this fucking game! Just let me up. Just let me up. <laughs> oh my god. Boo. 
if someone comes back right now, they'll be like, oh, we're still stuck on the wheel. It's like, no, we weren't. Two seconds ago, we weren't. Oh my god. <laughs> what happened? I slipped, but how? Why is this? I'm back. See? See? See what I mean? I was there. I was there. I was up there. I got up the balls and everything, and then it fucking fucked with me. It was like, oh, you're happy about being up there? Back down. Back down. My fingers hurt. You jinxed it. <laughs> Dude, this just came out. I know. <laughs> Gonna come find you and get yeah, more punch. Baby. That's what I've been waiting for. <laughs> oh my god. See, I mean, I heard everything. I was doing a thing, and <laughs> she did it and fell. I didn't even fall. It pushed me off. It like, literally, just fucking like, like, burp. like it just it pushed me off. I don't remember what I did. I was just doing stuff. Hip, hip. Oh, oh. Fuck, it's right there. Yeah, this is big brain time. Mark, Mark, help me, Mark. <laughs> Oh my god, Oasis! 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 Oh my god, I'm in the fight of my fucking life. Hip, 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 this is worse than Applebee's. <laughs> oh my god. Well, Applebee's has a pasta, doesn't they? Don't they? They're not even an Italian joint. Why do they have pasta? I don't even know, man. Hip. Oh, come on. It is pretty good pasta though, I will give them that. Or at least it, it tastes decent enough. I keep getting close. Hip. Doesn't they? Listen man, don't correct my grammar. <laughs> I'm the best grammar. You have to just stop thinking about achieving it and talk about random stuff and you'll get it again. Yeah, gotta get in the zone like, a, like the game grumps. Have y'all seen that? What was it? Uh, game? Not Game Boy. It was some type of like, I don't even remember, but it, it has a ton of animations of it because of how funny it was. Holy shit, what was that? Oh my god. Um, but it was like he was getting in the zone and he was just like telling random stories, Aaron Hansen, and then like he would he kept fucking up. The best at grammaring, exactly. Auto zone, auto zone. Don't they have like a little jingle? The auto zone is on your side. Well, that's nationwide. Uh, fifteen percent or more can save you on huh? car parts at AutoZone. <laughs> Jeepers, creepers! That's a horror movie thing. Where'd you get those uh, windshield wipers? Jeepers, creepers! Where'd you get that oil? I don't know. <laughs> what do they sell at AutoZone? <laughs> An avoidable chin move. Best game goes. <laughs> yes, exactly that one. Oh my god. Yep, yep, the Hawaiian pizza. But he was allergic to Hawaiian pizza. And so... I don't even remember what happened to the pineapple pizza. Does anyone remember? Something. Something happened to it. I don't know. He was like, Oh, but I was allergic and this and this and this fucking this and <laughs> Oh my god, I fucking love the Game Grumps. I love the little bit that they have with the little dinosaurs during the power hours. I love the power hours. I like them like... I don't know, I just think they're so funny. They're just so funny. You know, it was funny actually. There's this, uh... So like at one point, one of my friends introduced me to like this other YouTube... Oh my god. Oh my god, fuck! I was right there! Uh, this other YouTube duo, right? Uh... What is it? Like... Something and... <sighs> Shit, I don't remember. But they ha they were like these drag queens, right? And they they would do kind of like a podcast kind of thing. Um, and like, I enjoyed watching them too, right? Because like my friend showed me it and she was like, look, I really like watching this. And I was like, oh, that's so cool. And so I would watch it too. And I was like, yeah, you know, this is kind of funny. And then I was thinking about it and I was like, why do they remind me of someone? And I realized, like, oh my God, they're just like the game rooms. <laughs> and I showed her and like she... Like, she thought they were funny too, but she didn't get too into it, and so like, I was kind of like, I don't know, I think they're like exactly the same, just like for different demographics. <laughs> I wonder how much one costs. I don't think banjos cost that much, do they? They probably don't cost as much as... They're probably like around the same price as an acoustic guitar, no? You had to finish the sentence, he stopped and focused on the game. So true. So true, I should've... Ooh! Should've just... 
kept getting into the zone, auto zone. My wrist hurts. Oof. Oof. Here we go. But yeah, let's see what else. What else have they done? Their Doki Doki to Literature Club thing, the Amnesia playthrough. I think was it Amnesia? I don't know. It was the one where they were like in a hallway or something, and they kept like going through looping and stuff. I don't know. And then. I actually don't remember too much about that one. I used to watch them a lot. I don't watch them so often. You know Rhett and Link, right? From Good Mythical Morning? Like, the first time I encountered them, one of my friends was like, Hey, let me show you something. And she showed me, like... I don't know. I used to love their videos of, like, Will it corn dog? Will it breakfast? And they would try, like, restroom magician and stuff like that. <laughs> I thought it was really funny. Oh, my God. I forget why she showed me a video of theirs, but she introduced me to them and ever since then I was like, oh my god. And I thought they like weren't that big on YouTube and stuff. I thought they were like a niche thing. But like now they're like really big and it's so insane. Yep. Yep. Counted them IRL. Like IRL, bro. <laughs> what? I made it past the wheel and fell tragically. Yeah. Let's see. We're still on the wheel. I was done with your birthday art pie. I'm so tired right now. Going to sleep, I'll come back when I wake up. If I'm still streaming, then welcome back. Well, you know, I'll welcome you back then, but if not, I probably won't be streaming for much, much longer. I'm supposed to be off already. I'm supposed to be off already. I'm supposed to be off already. Yeah. Come on. Will it fondue, brother? Come here with the jam covered in so much melted cheese. Yes, yes. Oh my god. I love those. I used to love those, like, little food experiment ones. And I loved it whenever they used to do, like, a lot more of the mythical kitchen. <laughs> cooking stuff now they kind of changed it but before they were like oh we're prepping for this video and they're like they would go through like the different stuff that they're doing to make the the recipes that they would have to make and it was so interesting to watch but they don't do that as much anymore you know what i was realizing too you remember when buzzfeed was like a big thing and stuff uh it's, it's it was kind of like or it worked in the same way that like vtuber agencies work but for irl people Cause like that's a thing that exists but i kind of forget it exists because i don't know maybe just because i'm in the vtuber sphere a lot more but i realize it because like you remember that that giant exodus of a lot of their creators and they were like oh yeah i, I left buzzfeed because this and there was a lot of like issues with the company that's so much <laughs> like the vtuber sphere it's just so strange you know someone say cheese oh no not the cheese hip 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 Hip, 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 hip. Please. Please, uh, may I, may I please have some cheese? Oh my god. This game is so fucking painful, bro. Pain cannot be fucking properly conveyed in words. It's an existence. It's an emotion. Can't. 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 Seem dehydrated. <laughs> Thanks. Oh my god. I genuinely am though. I'm gonna take a little flip of water. Oh, sorry. I hit the mic again. Oh wow. This one was open. That one was not sealed. Yo, welcome in, Tippy. Holy shit. Happy Friday. Hope your day's going well. If not, it looks better. Yeah, I've been at this for a hot minute. I got up, and then I went back down. And then I got up again, and then went back down. And now I'm back down. Uh, birthday pay. I'm gonna make me mention about the Chuck E. Cheese animatronics again. Not the Chuck E. Cheese animatronics, by the way. Did you look at that snout? What snout? Huh? Can, can y'all see whenever I look at my nose? I can never tell. Can y'all see that? So like moving I don't wanna... oh shit <laughs> oh god happy fanboy friday hope you've been well yeah i've been pretty good actually but yeah happy fanboy friday i forgot the fanboys have today <laughs> it's not free day for nothing right oh man but yeah hep, hep. hope you've been well too i know y'all been like i don't know I, I see the announcements but i haven't been able to like pop by streams and stuff been tragically behind work 
Ah, speaking of which, do y'all remember that I was telling y'all about that job that was like requiring me to do training, but it took forever on it because it was really, really boring. And then I was scared that they like weren't going to contact me back and that maybe I had to do another course that I accidentally discovered that wasn't on the main page. Uh, so they did send me an email, but it was like an auto-generated email and it was like, congrats, you finished the training. Uh, we should send you a link to your final test, like in a bit, in a couple days. And I was like, okay. Well, like, you know, it was an auto-generated email, so I didn't reply to it. But, yeah, so maybe, <laughs> maybe, <laughs> at the very least, the system thing. It's okay, we will DM you about something soon. Ooh, ooh, tippy cooking, tippy cooking, which has historically been a bad thing. <laughs> oh my gosh. But yeah, bet, bet. Oh, man. Hip, 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 hip. Oh my god. Climb too fast is a bad thing. Hep, 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 nope, okay. And across, and up, and across, and up, and across, and up, and across, and up. Wow, that decreased. <laughs> you, ma you made a bad turn in your thought process. Oh, man. Y'all know, okay, like, TikTok is scarily good at keeping me online, so I don't get on TikTok a whole lot because I will literally spend the whole day there and then I'll feel like shit. But Instagram, it has a lot of my attention, but also the t the the Instagram algorithm is so, like, kind of wonky. Because if I stay on one video, then I'll get a bunch of videos of that. But it doesn't happen with everything. Like, some things I want more videos of and I'm, like, I struggle to get videos of that. Like, for example, VTubers. I get barely any videos about VTubers on Instagram. But... The ones that I get a lot of on Instagram are those, like, inspirational ones where it's like, oh, what is it? It's like, oh my god. Uh, like, I don't even remember. Like, you have yourself an intentional good day and stuff like that, right? And stuff like that. And then, like, oh, y'all y'all know Pop Pop? Does anyone know Pop Pop? I think we should take a break. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! No break! there we go but yeah the tea with pop pop i watched that one too i like that one it makes me happy i like things that make me happy you know <laughs> i say that as i'm playing like this infuriating game which i find kind of ironic but it does kind of make me happy because i like like doing it regardless because i'm like yay i'm did it i'm did it <laughs> now i just need to oh. If I fall again, I'll, like, genuinely cry. Not really. I, I don't cry often. When I cry, I think of, like, very, very emotional things. Like, oh, one day, people I love won't be here. And I'm like, oh. <laughs> hey, up. Hey, up. Please. Wait, hold on. Let me grab on both hands. Then let me swing. Dang it. Yep. Dope anime. What's dope anime? Yep. Yep. Oh yeah, semi unrelated. But y'all know like like on Twitch, right? Whenever streamers are on there, they'll have like what is it, like seven something, seven something, seven emotes or something like that? Where it's like you type words and they turn into emotes on the screen. Um, <laughs> I don't have that in, I don't have that plugin installed. So whenever I'm on like streamer streams like that, I like, I'll see chat like putting them and I'll see them on screen. And so I kind of understand. <laughs> Rather than like installing it, what I do. Oh, okay, I see. What I'll do is I'll just, like, type out the word, too, rather than, like, installing it, so I don't actually see anything. 7TV, yeah, that. They have, for you they have it for YouTube, too? Oh, shit! I can get a for my birthday? Joking. Hmm. Hmm. Dudesits, can you make Unimo a mod? Unimo, don't do anything. Once you If you do anything, I'll ban you for life. <laughs> but, yeah, I just like being involved. I just like pretending that I'm like, oh, my God! Oh, that was so fucking mean. Maybe I'm not supposed to go up. I can't remember. I feel like I did go up last time. And I feel like I went up fucking relatively easy. 
I can? <gasps> no, I, I don't know if you can. I, I thought you were saying you can, but I see the question mark now. Uh, I'm asking if you can. Because if you can, then yeah. But if not, then no, because I'm, I'm in the very important part of this journey where I have to, like, go up. Up. Oh. Hip. There we go. Okay. Okay. We're moving like a sloth. My fingers feel like they have fucking arthritis, bro. They're like clenched. I have to show you on the next hand stream, but like, I have like that weird thing where if I bend them slow, they like kind of get stuck at a certain joint. I don't think I have, I don't know, I haven't been to the doctors in a hot minute. She's locked in. For real, for real. I don't see the option in my things. Ah, okay. Sorry, Unimo. No mod for birthday. It's probably good, because then, like, you know that saying, you're like, Oh, if I do it for you, I have to do it for anyone. No, Pip, don't touch both wires. It's fine. It's fine. I don't know if I'm... Okay, good. <gasps> no, the beam part! I was so proud of myself that I got past it so quickly. I was like, oh, yeah. You know, it's fine, because I was able to get past it. Oh, no. I feel like I got to a really important part. Right as I wanted to end. That's not even on there, bro. That's not... Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Stop being so fucking dramatic. He like, let me reach so fucking far. I'll grab the moon. It's like, bro, it's two feet in front of you. Stop. Okay, right there. Hip. Yeah, okay. Yep, okay, good. Hip. Hip can actually grab air. Damn. <laughs> Airbender paprika? Patience pet. <laughs> Try it. I'm trying so hard. Controllers do not have patience, though. This one. This one. Oh. I don't know why, but like last time I was here, I was not as afraid of falling as I am now. <laughs> Maybe it's because like I fell and then I remembered that I could fall. I don't want to jinx anything. <laughs> Hands are so fucking <laughs> Oh fuck. I think right after this one is a pool, so it's probably fine. Okay, get to the very end. Alright. Uh, switch hands. Fuck. Might be able to reach it on the way up. Nope, way too far. Okay, gotta redo it. I need to be- oh, holy shit. On my right hand. When that happens. Pipes aren't actually coming. <laughs> I think it's like a rite of passage for all peppers. You gotta get caught by the pipe at, at least once in your life. Hip, 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 hip. Reach down, damn you! Fuck! Please on the way up, please on the way up, please on the way up. 
Oh, you fucking bastard, bro. You were swinging so much and then you slowed down. I mean, I know it's because I was right there on the end, but still, how fucking dare you, bro? Yeah. Sorry. I'm yeah. <laughs> sorry. You're probably very nice, Bean. You probably mean well. You're just probably just doing your job, but like, goddamn, that pissed me off so badly. Okay. Because it's like so easy to move across it while it's like flat, but as soon as it starts like angling really bad, it's hard to get any grip. <laughs> Physics, how dare you? Exactly. Fucking shit! Oh my god. Oh dang it. Hip. Am I gonna get banned for mentioning other streamers like Luca? No, 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 no. As long as you're not like, hey, this streamer is boring. <laughs> Go watch this other streamer. You know, as long as you're not like, oh, I stream guys and I'm so much funnier than her, you know. As long as you're not like that, like you can mention other streamers, but just don't be like fucking rude about it. <laughs> don't be like, oh, you're so fucking boring. This other streamer is so funny. Because then it'll make me sad. And then, you know, this is my space. So I can just like, bloop. And then you're out of, out of existence. Get got, son. Yes. What the fuck, dude? We did not hire an acrobatics person. Hate when he does that. It's such a show off. He's like, look what I can do. Flips over. Like, stop. Stop it, bro. My muscles are all tense. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm so nervous. Stop doing that! I'm gonna kick your fucking ass! I'm gonna make it so that you have a goddamn reason your legs don't work. God. Sorry, guys. <laughs> oh my god, I swear to god, if you twist one more time, time. Cool. Cool. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, right there should be pool. <sighs> so glad it was. Alright, we're, we're fucking into here. Hands are sweaty, knees spaghetti. I literally am sweaty though. <laughs> oh my god, my favorite streamers and microwave. Wait, how's that work? <laughs> So at first I was like, oh, a radio streamer? That might be. I feel like he's using his legs all of a sudden to give him a bit easier. Now, for real, for real. Speaking of microwave, anyone remember that one channel that microwaved a bunch of things? See what happens? I think so. Sometimes the microwave exploded. Oh, man. Everyone faith in the moment's over. Nah, nah, it's fine. We're okay. We're good. All good. Rage quit. I don't even care. My fingers hurt. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired. My fingers hurt. Oh my god, am I allowed to say skill issue to that? <laughs> or will I also get banned too? Nah, as long as you're joking, and it, you know, for, if you feel like it's too harsh, where you're like, oh wait, I mean this in a joking way, but I don't want them to take it, like, seriously, and it kind of sounds serious, and just post, like, slash A or something, then it'll probably be fine. You're my favorite YouTuber. Aw, oh, thank you! Same as since I watched the first, first watch of Rika, I've been watching every stream or VOD, you know. Aww. Oh, that's so sweet. I'm glad. I'm, I'm glad people like me. I need the validation. I was gonna say, nah, you know, it's fine. I'm fine. King China, but no, honestly. <laughs> oh my gosh. But yeah, I get bored of VOD, so sadly. No, I felt that. It has to be like a game that I'm interested in for me to watch a VOD. Unfortunately, I like supporting like the VTubers and stuff, but sometimes I'm just like, eh, I don't know. Let's see. Thank God I may sleep. <laughs> Knowing that the game was beat. Yeah, it's beat. I finished. I finished the game. <laughs> You're like the kind of guy that would ban anyone. That's silly. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's see. No, wait. Do I look? I see. Oh, <sighs> Paprika's inability to read strikes again. <laughs> Never a bad day. Pep stream makers. That's a lot of zeros times better. <laughs> Especially if it's a skill issue. <laughs> Get good, Pep. Oh my god, Bozo slash J. See, that, that's funny. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I think I say Bozo a lot on stream. I was gonna be like, I don't know if I've said it on stream, but like, I do that a lot. Like, you Bozo. <laughs> but yeah, oh, okay, I will take a sip. Whew, man, we did it. We got to that pool. 
we reclaimed our spot. We got to the same part we were at, but like, that's fine as long as we don't. I hope this stream, I hope this game doesn't have like a repeating pattern whenever I stream it where it's like, I start off at point one, I get to checkpoint two, and then I go back to like checkpoint negative one, and then I get back to checkpoint one, and then like rinse and repeat. Night pep is nearly midnight. Ooh, have a good night. Bye bye. But yeah, with that, drink your milk, eat your vegetables, don't talk to strangers, or at least try to spend judgment. And I will see y'all all, all t uh, well, some of y'all tomorrow, but most of y'all next week. Bye bye. Holy shit, I'm I'm angry now. <laughs> I know why that is. Oh wait, that's not it either. Oh, that's scary. Oh, that's weird. Oh, I have so many things I'm just now discovering. Okay, there we go. Bye-bye! I, I did not realize that was there, but anyway, bye-bye! <laughs> oh, man. All right, let me find the tab. Hold on, I lost it. I lost it. Bye-bye! Okay,